I'll cut it off, I'll cut it off. I'll cut it off you. You let her bait him. No, no, I'll cut it off for you. I'll cut it off for you. That is funny. Oh, I'm on crud today, you know. Oh. After, after, after what I've experienced, bro. I'm on crud. On what anyone. did you experience? Or Just what have you experienced? Things, um, Just a lot of things. The past since the start of twenty nineteen, yeah, I've experienced so much shit that I'm just like I'm on crud, fam. Enlighten me. Just you, you know why? <laughs> I saw a lip twitch. You know one. Oh uh, yeah. You know one. <laughs> Obviously, certain like I'm trying to get pe- certain people here. Some people cancel and <laughs> that as well. So that as well. Just stress of doing the pod and that. I guess. Mm. I'm trying to. Have to just push through and up. Mm. Is what it is. Is what it is. But yeah, we're waiting for more people though. Mm-hmm. Um. So I don't know who where they will sit. They'll sit probably. Ah, uh, the Mando are moving a bit mad. I don't even know. I don't know how flipping Michael broke his glasses. To be honest. Do you know I've never seen this guy drunk, and I, I I've You've heard... never seen Michael drunk. No, not drunk. <laughs> Not drunk, drunk. I've, I mean, I've been with him drinking and stuff like that. Carnival is a different type of drunk for him, bruv. <laughs> and I always you hear these what? stories about him, mm-hmm. like, mash-up. He, he's mash-up still. He would be mash-up still. But, um, yeah, let me get this intro out the way while we start having more conversations. Anyway, eh, welcome, welcome, welcome. Get Thinking Podcast, episode 53. Um, everybody late. <laughs> <laughs> um, more people are coming anyway, so... I'm here, Ish is coming up after work, Chad's not here, Jamal's not here, but um, yeah, J- Jamili's back, Serafina's back, Yo. Uh, Uncle's coming soon, Um, with someone as well, Ish is coming, so yeah, 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 we've got bad people, Um, you want to do a little bit of promo for yourself, do your um, <laughs> or no? I hate when people put me on the spot, but I'll just say that um, I've yeah. put out uh, Instagram or slash blog sort of thing about... um. Me and my partner eating and going to different restaurants and trialing it out and reviewing them. So it's it's very new, so bear with me and it's called the Futu. So check that out on Instagram. I'll I'll do I'll do bear um uh what you call it, noises and that. You know what I mean? Sound effects. What um, ASMR? Yeah. Can you do that? Can you do ASMRs? This I is can... hitting me a bit no, I'm drinking it too fast. Yeah, how, you're drinking too fast though. How oh lad god. How um <laughs> how strong is it? 17% And with the lemonade I, dr- I drank that too fast Yeah you drank that too fast though but yeah. Sorry I couldn't do it It's an enjoyable drink though it? That's why okay, cool. But I know my friend Like Ruben can Because he like He doesn't eat with his mouth closed I'm like alright cool Because my friend wants to start up a YouTube In the works So he's like I was like to him Cool I'll cook Ruben can do reviews And you just record Because I like to cook I've got a whole food page Uh, For all the babes and That'll be mm-hmm. watching this his uh, Instagram is in the description below. So if you want, you you get some free food, fresh free food. food. He'll be cooking in it. Hmm. You get me? They don't have but to pay to for come. that shit. So they they can do a thing. <laughs> I mean, I mean, they'll be and he. <laughs> I was gonna say something else, but I was like, wait, you know what? I need to relax. But yeah, like started a whole Instagram page. So far, as on eighty followers, but Jeez. hopefully we can build that over time. How long have you been doing that? Um, How long did you do that for? Not actually that long. Mm. But it's like... Mm. I've been cooking since I was like 12. It's that Jamaican thing though. Yeah. Mm. You start from young. Start from 12. Like my first photo was 17th of October 2018. Oh, that's not bad. But like... I've only recently started to properly... That's what I mean. It's difficult to keep going. And I'm hearing that you have to keep uploading like every like other day or stuff like that. And even... I was meant to upload last week, Friday, but, you know, Drake and... <laughs> yeah, we'll talk, we'll talk, we'll talk, we'll talk. We'll talk. Okay. I know you're jealous, isn't it? We'll talk, we'll talk. Drake, J. Huss, you know. I am jealous for... The we'll talk, like, bruv. J. Cole. J. Cole. Oh, yeah, the last night, the, the last, last night that he had, that looked so good. Like, I, I, I wanted to see Popcorn, I can't lie. That's who I was into, but, yeah, you know. But, no, we'll talk about Drake in a sec, but, yeah. yeah. But now this whole Instagram thing is, mm. is I have to post at least what, every day for the, during the week for yeah. the pod. Um, it's cool. It's just hard finding good clips. Do you schedule? Do you have like a schedule where you're like, okay, this day I'm gonna yeah. upload that? No, I I upload at a certain time because between seven and nine. Is it? 
So AM? No, 7 no, PM. PM. I do it in the afternoon. Yeah. During the afternoon, kind of lunchtime. Everybody's on phones. On my insights, is like between 7 and 9. It's like the peak time for Instagram. I might do that. I might start doing that. I might do it a little bit like 5 after 5. Mm. Yeah, I, I tried work. the 7 and 9 thing. Not that that's what my insights are saying, but it's just that I thought, yeah, everyone finished mm-hmm. work. They're looking through their phones sort of thing. Yeah, yeah. Everyone looks through their phone <coughs> and through the gym and that as well. So, yeah, so, uh, this Instagram shit is hard, man. Mm. Speaking of Instagram, before we go to Drake, um, <laughs> had everybody seen this uh, Instagram woman on, and she was like crying that she has to go to a, back to a 95? <laughs> Nine to five. No, I heard about it. Basically, th- I don't know what's her name. Yeah, I forgot. She's like an Instagram model. Yeah, and uh, her Instagram account got deleted. Yeah, <laughs> and um, she went on. I think it was she uploaded a video on YouTube or something like that, and she said, "Um, yeah, um, like I'm go- upset. I can't live anymore. I'm not gonna make any more money. I'm a useless person. I can't work a nine to five. Mm-hmm. I can't believe I have to do that." Da, 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 da. And I was just like, "This is how you know the, this is what you're scramming shit, bro." Like, so do you think she done that so that people feel sorry for her? Yeah. Do you think people feel sorry for her? No. no. She's an Instagram model. Yeah, but let's break it down. When you really think about it, imagine that is your nine to five. Yeah, Instagram all day, every day. Instagram then... your nine to five. You don't have anything. You don't have a Twitter account. You don't have flipping. YouTube. Yeah, but that's no, but your... See, that's Do you have any other, the other ones? That doesn't make sense to me. I feel like people that have made Instagram such a big platform that people are relying on it now, like, cool, you are a fitness model or whatever. Mm. Go into doing the fitness stuff with clients. Mm. Why are you using Instagram? If to you promote s- yourself. No, but that's the thing. If you're you saying could do, you, you can make these games, why are you, you not doing that? You don't need... You don't need... You don't... And you, also, you don't need... um, You don't need Instagram like that. You... you but mainly people what you, what the main thing that people use is YouTube for that type of shit mm-hmm. Simeon Panda think... is an example Simeon Panda is a perfect example for yeah that. but I feel like if you're just starting out you can't just have a YouTube if you're like if you're new you no can't people just have can. A, you can what straight away yeah I thought not? like to promote yourself like Instagram will be the first like Instagram Twitter bit. and YouTube yeah why not Facebook well, that's the thing. The best thing is word of mouth, so... Yeah, yeah. just do it. Yeah, but, but start it. Just at least start it. There's there's some type of platform for where someone can contact you in mm. any other mm. way. That's how I see uh, social media is. So, like, with like with here, like, you can listen and watch, bro. Like, mm. yeah. you have so much avenues where people use it. I mean, so... This is, this is what it is. But her, it's just funny, because she actually said that she doesn't want to go back to a 9 to 5, and I'm like... You better get that there's job. nothing. Uh, there's nothing wrong with a nine to five. Like I yeah. do it. Everybody does it. Everyone well, does I do it. a ten to six. <laughs> My G. <laughs> but like, yeah, everybody's got a day job and still does what they have to do, fam. But it's funny because why? Like, if that okay. So if your choice was what, what would you want to do? If if you had a choice to, you will still get money or whatever. Would you? Want what to do type of money five? though? Like, what you're getting now. Or I more. want more though. Okay, say so if you're getting more, let yeah. me get a mil a week. Come on, man. Let's not be silly. <laughs> nah, I'm actually, I'm actually being serious. Like let's, I want a hell of a lot more. Let's not be silly. If you had a I'm choice, I'm just saying though, because I would rather personally, I would rather work at home and work on my own. That's what I would prefer mm. to do than going mm. out to work nine to five. I think that's everybody though. Personally, but I don't know. Okay, so I forgot what my point was. But I think <laughs> what would you rather do? What would you rather do? Yeah, so I was like, what would you rather do? So her choice was she got it through Instagram or whatever, yeah? yeah? So why can't, she, why can't she enjoy life, do nothing on Instagram? She's getting money for it. That's how she's getting her income. No, why I'm... should everybody do the same thing, nine to five? No, think no she it. doesn't have to do a nine to five, but at the same time, you can't just put all your eggs in one basket. That's no. the way I think. It. That's yeah. what she did. Yes, which she did. Now she's screwed. <laughs> Because I've seen a lot of Instagram models make mm. backup pages because of that right there. Yeah. yeah. So like... Like secret secret pages, yeah. Like if you're making such a big page mm. and you have to make a backup page, you need to find something else to put your energy into. Yeah. Make a YouTube. Mm. True, true. Yeah, true. make make sure you have got different avenues to where you can make money. Do you know that... We, we spoke about this before, like pretty privilege is real on YouTube. It mm-hmm. is. Like... Definitely. The man didn't watch these makeup things just because they're buff mm-hmm. do you yeah vlogs yes 
earlier. I watched the thing Fuck earlier. Off. You guys actually watch makeup vlogs. And not shit. makeup vlog. Just the vloggers because they're, they're spices. I, I've, isn't I've it? watched a couple, but because I've known the person. Okay, that's all right. I, I, I watched some. I just watched some of them because they're buff. Yeah, I'm not even gonna oh. front. Because you know, there was this. What there's one thing that's there's, there was this one thing I watched. Yeah, and I was like. I think it was her and her sister on the video or something like that. She was talking about um, like evil. Com- How do f- I forgot? You know, like people, their assumptions of them or some shit. They do video of that, mm. like ask questions on Instagram. Mm. They ask like, "What was your worst assumption of us?" Like back in the day, and they were answering it on the YouTube video. And I was just there, like, I don't really care about your assumptions. One of you is buff. That's really why I watched it for. And I follow I her on the ground. I'll show you in a second. I honestly don't get it because by you watching them, what is it gonna do for you? Nothing except from just. I wanted to pre. Because she's buff. Wow. I have no, I have no shame on that because every man has done it. It's a straight fact. It is what it is. It is what it is. Was you up late last night? Why are you yawning? <laughs> Trust me, Rev. Why are you yawning, fam? You said you were asleep. You look tired. I'm always tired. <laughs> Listen, I'm always in work, and everyone's like, "Do you want to go to bed?" I'm driving a forklift, mind, so it's like... Oh, shit. Mm, yeah, I'm falling yeah. asleep at work all the time, to be fair. I don't know. I shouldn't move. I got to do some overtime that. soon as well. Is it? Yeah. Get that money up. Trust me. Get She's it. a spice, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And you know the reason why I'm watching now. Fuck off, mm-hmm. bruv. And you wanna... Yeah, but well, by you watching, it's not friends. gonna... It's not gonna make... It's not gonna make... Any, nothing is going to happen from it, is it, really? No, I just wanted to pre. You never you know. Never oh, know. Yeah. But you never know, though, as well. Just laws of attraction. very, very familiar. Mm, she's very popping on YouTubes. Laws of attraction. Yeah, man. You never know. If I meet her in an event and that, I'm shooting my shot, fam. Oh, hey. Shoot a friend. <laughs> yeah, but remember that we've had... This, remember hey, what? do you want a friend? That might be a title, you know? <laughs> that might be the title already. I'm but sorry. did you, you say that you, um, you don't... You don't... Um, Chat to people in clubs and stuff like that. Like Not in the don't... club. I said an event. So have you made any changes since I last spoke to you about? You know... a... To be honest, you know what? I'm gonna keep it clean. Yeah. <laughs> I ha- I'm trying to. You need to do it, man. Honestly. I'm trying to. You need to yeah. get I'm out trying of that to... I'm just the conversation. I, I'm because tr- me and her um have been having discussions like oh, like about me like going up to girls and that in clubs and shit because I don't do it. I don't do it either. Yeah. Why? So what? Do you expect girls to come up to you? No, 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 no. no, no. So why go on then? I just, I just haven't. I just, to be honest, it's a scared thing because I did it once. Obviously, I got rejected and I kept moving. But in my heart, I was like, Ugh! oh no, I'm the boss. <laughs> that's oh, why I would shit. never. That's why I'm kind of glad that I'm a girl, you know, because <laughs> I can't be, I can't be doing them things. That's know? why girls I cannot handle rejection. Yeah, yeah. yeah. girls can't handle I rejection. I feel so shame. Yeah, but at the same time, now I'm just like, all right, cool, it's whatever. But at the same time, I don't do it. Like that, like, but um, now I'm kind of changing. Mm. Like, I nearly shot my shot with this one thing. You know? <laughs> nearly. Let me let me give you the backstory. Okay. Cool. So, I um I I was in London. Yeah, mm. went Selfridges looking for um, um a Mother's Day gift, mm-hmm. and um, I was walking past um all the per- the perfume cologne places. Obviously, Tom Ford had to stop by a car, mm-hmm. but I needed to smell good in that. But um, went to went to this. It was like some brand in London, in it. It's like a exclusive brand in Selfridges, mm. uh, some elite one. It's like a hundred and eighty per bottle for a fifty oh. mil, fifty mil. Bruv, it's like handmade. It's like fully handmade and shit. Some elite shit, yeah. So, but the thing is, I was walking past, but the only reason I stopped just. To, this? Hold on, let me go back to my team. Who's this? The name is right there. Yeah, but who, how do you... Oh, goddamn 47. Wow. I, I just, I'm just baffled, you God know. Damn. Honestly. I just, I just don't know... Where? Okay, I can't lie yet. I'm on Instagram and I like looking at girls. I'm not a lesbian, by the way, but I just like <laughs> I like looking at girls and whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Girls are looking at, go- at girls more than guys do. Yeah, just... yeah, but nothing is ha- gonna happen. I don't get it. What you just watch and fantasize or what? No, <laughs> I don't do anything. What, what do you expect? Why do you like looking at girls? Motivation, body motivation, and that. Yeah, what's your motivation? Huh? What's your motivation? I like cheeks. 
I wasn't mm-mm. okay. Well, I was gonna say, what are you what what are you doing with that? But okay, cool. I don't know. Say no more. Listen. <laughs> say no more. Oh mm. God! But yeah, continue the story. Yeah. So walk past the thing. <laughs> I, the thing is, the only reason I stopped there because I clocked this one penguin. Did my she sweet work there? one. Yeah, she worked on the store. Okay. And I was like, hmm. And she kept looking at me. So I was just like, so I, I was like, fuck it. Let me just ask. You know what I mean? Mm. Like, oh, what, what's this brand? Like, I'm kind of curious. And she was telling me, da 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 da. And then, um, yeah, I'm looking for a gift, da 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 da, for my mom. It's like, oh, yeah, cool. Like, I'm only here for the day. So I'm just kind of looking for. I was like, oh, where are you from? Like, from Bristol, our way, and that, uh, and so blah, blah. And then I was just curious about her ethnicity. I was like, can't guess what it is so i just asked her and it's like oh like what's your ethnicity like i'm, I'm kind of curious if you don't mind if you don't mind me asking mm. and she was like she's saying it's like colombian and something else oh fam <laughs> i mean she was why are i light up for because she said the exact race of someone i met <laughs> in the exact same situation so done. but it was even peak because i broke my phone ah. went into o2 and i was like oh yeah like I can still receive calls or whatever, but I have no screen. Oh shit! She didn't believe me. I was mm. like, "Listen, if you want, you can call my phone, innit? Yeah, yeah. In her head, she's like, "All right, cool. I'm gonna get his number." I was like, "Okay, it works." And then I was like, "We've been friends ever since." Aww. But she was Colombian. I was like, "Yeah, but th- with me, I was just like, and That's she was, cute. and I, when she was writing down which, um, you know, when you sprayed the sachet on it, mm-hmm. yeah." I was I was thinking like oh should I just like while she was writing um the names of the uh the perfume in that I was wanted to ask her. You write your number yeah, I was wanted to say that, but, but the, you didn't. No, because then I was realized, <laughs> and then I realized like, and then I was like, well, no, nah, I shouldn't be doing this shit. Bro. This is her manager's right there in the corner, fam. That's a bit weird. You know what I mean? Like it's a bit, you know. You know what I feel. But then at the same time, I was like, I wish I did it, but then like. I kind of I know, know I know what you it's mean. It's like it's courage as well. Like yeah. I don't have the I didn't have the courage at the time because I was still I'm in a vulnerable place in it. <laughs> so at the same time, it, like, you, you know, know what I mean? feel like, yeah. In those situations, if it's done the right way, like they like the Was that the right way though? That was the opportunity. That was definitely opportunity. Shit, Isn't man, it? fuck. That was of definitely opportunity. Like, was. oh, do you want to write your number? On and there then too? she will feel sweet too. Do you know what I mean? The yeah. only thing she could say is, "Oh, I have a man." Then okay, keep oh, it moving. She was a sweet one still. You never know, she might still work there. Yeah, when I go back. Yeah, you never know. I've been in the same predicament as you. Like, I've just put, like, a sweet one in Fort Asylum in Cardiff. Went in to buy a pair of shoes for a night out. We were talking about shoes, and I was like, all right. Like, we, I just thought we can compare shoes one day, and I was like, I just didn't say it. Shit, bro. This is what I mean, bro. Us, man, we literally have some certain opportunities. I'm just like, fuck, bro. But you know what they say, as one door closes, another one opens. Never mind. It wasn't to be. You never know. I might see her again. You never know. Yeah. If never. you see her again, you have to I have to shot. ask for the number. Actually, I have, have to. to. If you don't shoot I actually shot, have to, then... you know. I have yeah. to. No, I have not, no excuse, bro. It's not even a, oh, yeah, I've seen her again. It's like, you actually have to because it's actually fate saying you were meant to meet her again. Yeah. But I don't... Mm, you never know. Never know. Because 7 because... billion people on this world. Yeah, trust me. Yeah, but unless you go to the same shift at the same time, then that's... no. No, 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 no. Why? I don't, I don't know where she... I, I just went there by chance, bruv. You go there another Saturday and you'll see her again at the same time. I got studios. I got studio time to do, bruv. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> but you I never know. Commitments. Yeah. But at the same time, like, like, I'm trying to work on that. Just kind of just going up to mm. you know, someone and just having... Yeah. Trying, trying something. Yeah, that should be... That should be... Well, the next time I see you... I'm I'm hoped that I hear a story where you've just done it, yeah. even if it's a rejection. At least you've done it. I've done it before. It's just and I got rejected. I just don't haven't done it in so long. Like, do you feel like you've lost touch? Yeah, yeah. I just don't. I just feel like. Do you have any tips? Man said tips, you know. Raw. <laughs> no, no, but I'm just saying. Like, I I, I think I will when I ha- I think it's just courage. I think it's just yeah, bravery and courage. That's what it is. Just yeah. believe in your source. Yeah, I do believe. And in you my have source. source. I don't even know why you're carrying on. You know you have source as well. Come on, you know that you have source. To be honest, my CV is calm still. <laughs> I've you said this on the pod. Hundred percent success rate. No, you you know like she's one of my brethren. Like she knows, isn't it? So you know, in it. 
Hundred percent. When I, you, when you have yeah. female friends, yeah, that know that mm-hmm. that know you got the t- you. Yeah, you know I mean, come on, bro. I hate it when mandem don't believe me. I'm like, all right, cool, do your thing. Mm. Not my fault. <laughs> Yeah, so next time, yeah. Yeah, like t- I'm still. Working. And you'll go London next weekend as well. Yeah. So there's no excuse. Okay, no excuse, bro. Not that we have to go to London to find. You were meant to come with me, you know. I know. I know. You were meant to come baby with me. Baby shower commitments. You got baby shower though. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna send you best snaps, you know. Yeah. Do it. I'm actually gonna do it. <laughs> do it. I'm gonna put it in my really, story I and really her to... directly. I <laughs> really, I really want to. I really want to go to that. Yeah, and I'm going the night after as well to another different place. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Oh, it's bank holiday as well, isn't it? Cool. Around that. Oh, that's I why it's gonna forgetting. be lit. That's gonna, it's gonna be lit. I got. I literally got four days off. Lucky. So, that's why I'm doing this overtime just in case. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Might, might as well. So, when do you think? When are you gonna go down? Good Friday. Twentieth. Oh, Sun. Sorry. sorry. Oh, I'm, I'm record. I think. Yeah, twentieth probably twentieth because mm. I got a session and all that. Oh, um, okay. Cool. I got a few things to do. But um, yeah, found an Airbnb pretty cheap as well. Actually, mm, imagine hundred pound, hundred pound for two nights. That's really good. Girls Court, really yeah. Good. So it was really good by chance. And at least with London, like as long as you're nearby a station, it's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's all right. Yeah, as long as uh, to be honest, I don't need much. No, you don't. I don't need much. But in my birthday, I I wanted a hotel just in case. But mm. this one's not. It shouldn't be too bad. Too well, it's better the one because obviously I can't visualize the one at Carnival or. The one that you've done this time, do you think it's better? The carnival one was better. Okay. The carnival one was better. You saw that room. That room was lit. Mm. But um, yeah. Let's speak about this Drake thing though. So explain, bruv, because so. she was at the J when J Hus got freed up, bruv. So yeah, I mean, it was basically yeah. I have to explain the story. So we got so me and my boyfriend, we got there. And we had to the O three to the O three, <laughs> and obviously he was getting that. vexed because I, I was taking long. Old. Anyway, whatever. You're long. And, women are always long. The first. thing is, you yeah, I was. We had what? a massive argument about this. I didn't take long, but anyway, we'll speak about that another time. Yeah, because it wasn't cool. my fault. And we got there. <laughs> We've been saying that all the time. Anyways, we got there and imagine our seats was like four, like you know, like right at the back, back, like the top, top levels, row, like yeah. level four or something like that. Yeah. And then, um, cause we got there kind of early. So, um, Baku was like playing nobody, like, that's what I don't understand. Like the, a lot of people that go to these Drake concerts, they don't know about these people. Baku's hard though. Do you know what I mean? Baku's way more Like more we were, hilarious. oh, nah, you know, sang. the you know, the one hit wonder that he's got. The man. Live up to my name. You know it. Even on my pain. I was going to try to sing it, but I thought that I can't. Oh, just Spotify. Right? Yeah, yeah, just do it. It's hard. You, That's hard. You know it. Everyone knows that. Everyone song. has Even song. if people say that, they don't know who he is. But anyway, so he was playing and there was like hardly anybody there. So there was no, there's nobody checking tickets at the yep. level one. Yeah, you know it. Isn't it? Yeah. No one was checking tickets at the level one, you know. Those seats cost, like, over £200 or whatever. Yeah, yeah, I tried. So we, so we went down there, yeah. We sat in, like, a row that was basically empty. Nobody was coming. Tory Lanes sat there, fine. And I was, like to, I was like to my boyfriend, okay, if, like, people come to sit here, then we'll move back to our seats back up the top, innit? Yeah. But I was like, we're staying down here tonight. Yeah. Like, we're staying down here. So anyway, we were there right up until Drake comes and that's when everyone started coming in. I was like, oh shit, we're going to get moved. So anyway, um, like I really need to go to it as well. You know, when I drink, I need to piss or whatever. So yeah, I was like, oh yeah, shit, yeah. how am I going to go back in? So I was like with the guy, I was like, remember me, remember me. Like I don't have my ticket. My boyfriend's got my ticket. I was saying all this bullshit in it, saying to remember me. And I came back down. My mind wasn't there anyway. Fine. Then all these people started coming down to the seats and we're like, shit, we're going to have to move now. Yeah. So we started going up and I was like, nah, we're not we're not going up to level four tonight. We yeah. are staying right yeah, on this yeah, level. Yeah. So we, we moved out of the way and then we saw um some free seats when Drake was playing. And then I made friends with this girl from Liverpool. I, I was pretending to be her best friend just in case the people then come. Wait, 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 was she a sweet one? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Definitely not. All right, cool. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Nowhere near her, okay, bro. Okay, okay, okay. She definitely wasn't. So anyway, um, then, and then... Uh, <laughs> Why are you laughing? For? We're so bad, Mike. I know, that's all you're there thinking the about. Facial expressions? Oh my, my god. My days. Yes. So um 
Oh yeah, so Josh's friends, they came to the thing as well. And then we saw them like by our bit as well, like in the level one part. Yeah. But they were standing on the stairway stuff. Yeah, yeah. And then the t- ticket guy came here and was like moving everybody out of the way. So I was like, these are my friends. I was like to the girl, like, we're, you know, we're friends, we're yeah. dads or whatever. They didn't even say nothing to me. Nothing mm. to me. I literally, <laughs> I literally, we said that the whole night. Mm. The whole night. Huh? Mm, go ahead. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. Literally said that the whole night I was enjoying level one, like better seats than anyone could even imagine. I would have rather sat there than be standing. Even if standing would have been lit, standing would have yeah, been I lit. Yeah, I'd rather sat down. But sat down where we were, There's a seat. amazing. It's a seat. Amazing. It is a seat. Well, not that we just sit down, but it's just that I could see Drake. You have ac- no, you have access to a seat is yeah. great. Yeah, yeah, it's true, it's true. It's but great. it was amazing. I'm telling you, it was amazing. Mm. It was Who amazing. Uh, did um the Tory bring out anybody at that time no but i was just happy to see tory because you remember what happened to me in berlin when i did oh, check all yeah, the way to yeah, berlin yeah, to see tory lanes yeah, yeah, and then he cancelled on the night yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. i was upset man. because tory because um who did, did drake I, i'm gonna shoot drake brought out like bangers bangers like you know what I mean? yeah um what did he say i can't even remember i was just too happy well, but he was um what was it did he bring out like obviously he brought out people and uh, obviously yeah. when he brought Huss, that was a moment yeah yeah he didn't bring um, out anybody else, just us. Just us? Yeah. At that night? Yeah. Shut on. I don't Obviously, know Tory Lanez and Buckle, they were like supporting acts of it, but he didn't bring out nah, anybody t- yeah, else. Yeah, true, true, true. But I oh. would, to be fair, I, I appreciate... Oh, you had a sweet one call you? No. Mate, the smile um, as well. Yeah, you had a sweet one call you? I can't remember call me. Huh? My little brother passed his driving test and my uncle called me instead of him. Oh, I was like, congratulations, I was like, wrong person. <laughs> oh. right, so anyway, shout out to your little brother no. big up my oh, guy congrats but yeah so yeah it was amazing i literally enjoyed myself so much yeah i wish i paid the 200 pound by the same time i'm not doing that nah, it's not worth for it. a ticket and bro. to be fair Not i much. paid i paid 80 pounds for my ticket and sat in a perfect perfect seat but you did that by chance though yeah god blessed you that night yeah literally there was was there standing yeah, they're standing, but to get standing was so difficult. It's like three, four hundred pounds. Right? No, it wasn't. It was, sure. like, it was like one hundred and thirty pounds, but they went so fast that no one could access because we were on Friday night, and obviously everyone would want to go on go Friday, Friday night. night. Yeah, I'd want to go to the last one. But... Yeah, the last one would look so good. Everyone came out. Um, Everybody. My... <laughs> call NSG and and NSG Seth one. London. I knew he was gonna bring out NSG last. I knew Listen, it. Why? Everyone on Instagram was like, if he brings out NSG, we got to apologize to them. I was like. You know he's bringing them out. Yeah, he's gonna bring them out. I d- I don't understand the apologies thing. What what have I missed? Everyone hates NSG for some reason. Why? Because they're always commenting on everything. Like they, on they, Instagram, they're comment, any, they're any meme on page, you just have to scroll. But once you see NSG comment, yeah, 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 I see that on like um. There's an account that I follow, and there's like, oh, they must like own this account or something because they're always commenting or yeah. whatever. Yeah, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like even... but, d- people get onto people for foolishness, man. Come on. Well, yeah, God. but yeah, it's cool. Like, as soon as he brought out Sneak Bow, yeah, it was like the night before or some shit. I was like, yeah, he's just gonna have to bring out NSG, fam. Mm. I th- he has to. There's no po- T on Wayne as well. Come yeah, on. that oh, all of that. He brought T on T on Wayne twice because of Russ as well, isn't it? He brought Russ out as well. No, sorry. He was so offbeat. <laughs> Who? Drake. Drake. His uh, gun lean was so. His gun lean, fam. Oh, bless him. It's big. But imagine seven days, you know, seven days straight. He just needs to get his UK citizenship. Yeah, yeah I think he will, bro. When some, when, when Twitter went mad as soon as Husk uh, dropped, um, as soon as um, Husk came out to, on the show, everyone was tweeting saying, yo, Drake has done more shit for the UK than the Theresa, Theresa May. Yeah. I said, mm-hmm. that is a tweet, fam. That is a tweet. It was, it was a good, it was really good. I mean, I, yeah. I've seen um, Drake before, but like, Ages ago, before everyone was like, you more you saw my wireless, isn't it? Drake, yeah, <laughs> Drake, Drake. Um, Drake. No, I saw my. I even forgot about that. Yeah, I saw my wireless, but I saw him in when he played that in Cardiff time ago. This uh, is when I was in college. Uh, okay, so, yeah. I haven't seen the Drake show yet. No. I'm surprised. Wait, what's what's going money, on? Money, man, money. It's legit money, mm. legit. Every time, yeah, is when I'm nearly like. I'm nearly broke. What you spend? I, I'm baffled. I, I want to know what you're spending your money on. I'm try, that's what I'm working on. It's literally just like boot, food, um, gym, paint. I imagine like I was, I'm paying still. Um, 
I'm still paying for my stuff in Philippines. Oh, okay. oh fair All that fair. stuff as yeah, well. Decent, yeah. yeah, so. Fair enough. I got like other stuff out there. All I'm saying is that I've, I'm doing something big. I told you this already, but I'm oh, going to yeah. wait until it happens and then I'll speak on it. Isn't it this month? She, she, uh, she, you know, yeah, she made that... me hide it. She, she was like, she, she kept hiding it from me. Yeah, I was just like, "What? Well, tell me, bruv It's April, fam. It's time. It's time." She's like, <laughs> "Don't worry, man. April, trust me." I'm like, "That's what my money has been blinking wasted on, bro." I'm, I'm assuming a holiday in it, but at the same time, apparently, I'm, I could be wrong. I was like, "Fuck off, bruv I want to tell. That's why I mention it. But I, is it gonna I'm be not... like lit to where like Mandem are gonna have to gas you up? That's a yes. Yes, a yes, fam. I, Wait, what? <laughs> is it going to be so lit to where we're going to gas you up on the gram and that? Yes. All I'm is. saying is that my boyfriend's not happy about it. Oh, swear. Jeez. Shout out to him. <laughs> <laughs> you had big, big... Listen. You know, <laughs> your face it reminds mm. me of that um that meme. No, no, no. no. Conceded. Yeah, I don't conceded know. One, yeah, it but... must be that. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But anyway, let's move on. <laughs> It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> Everybody say, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but no, man. I, to be honest, I'm on this movement now a little bit to gas up my female friends. What was it? Yeah. Gas what up my that? female friends. No, just in general. Like, what you do, I gas you up for it. Yeah. I, like, some of my friends. I'll post them on the gram and that. Yeah, well. I appreciate it. You know, it's the support. Yeah, I man. I like it. Yeah, man. Like, some of my friends are doing shit. a lot of people need to support these days. Yeah, my friends are doing shit, man. Why not? Why not? Like, you know what I mean? Not all the men don't need the, all the love like that. Like, mm. the women as well. Like, when I told that to my friend, she was like, oh, yeah, I feel, um, I feel like we're underappreciated sometimes. I'm like, hmm, interesting. So. I sent my friend a message the other day, like, I'm glad you finally got rid of the toxic people in your life and you're actually fl- um, flourishing. See, so a little thing like that, that's, that's all you need. I'm guessing it? up my female friends now, you know. They deserve that, fam. They deserve Are it. Are you still. sure there's no hidden agenda? No, no, no. Oh, because no, I'm no. like, Vicky, you look a bit smug about Guys it. Guys and girls can <laughs> just be friends. Yeah, man. Yeah. I don't really not? have any guy friends, you know. I Me. think I struggle. Yeah. Yeah, obviously you <laughs> might... <laughs> But I'm just like she I said nothing. No, like no. Obviously, you're my friend, but I'm saying I hardly have any guy friends, mm. which is sad. <laughs> That's not sad. It is sometimes I need I need like a uh, male male advice. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, I'm here, fam. Yeah, I know you're here. Yeah, I'm always. I appreciate here. it. Yeah, I'm always here. Like, I'm always open to it. You know what I mean? You always got to just. Or if you you got my number, fam. Yeah. <laughs> That's all it is. You got contact for me, fam. You know the ones like when you oh fuck it. You know when, um, <laughs> you know when you're talking to a ting, yeah, and mm-hmm. she's just like it's like it oh, always reverts back to this, you know. Ting. I don't give a fuck, fam. <laughs> like when they say like oh like I'm hard to communicate, I'm like then why do you have my number on my Instagram then? Am I that hard to communicate? There's with? so much. Am I scared? Me- I don't There's think so. so. Much Am I a scary media. person, fam? Am I a scary nah, person? I think you're like, cool. I'm open to talk like. But I think it's because I'm different. Like, I'm open to having a conversation. Same. You know what I mean? Some of these girls just don't like having a conversation sometimes about what they feel like. And I'm just there like, is it because of, I think, us men? I think feel, it's part of feel, experiences. Yeah. I think they're also scared of, like, losing us. Because we're really? such good guys, isn't it? Because I feel like girls are bitches, like, as friends. We're good friends. Good, good guys, Girl, you know? Girls, girls, I'm I just don't saying, know. No, I'm just saying, before yeah. we continue with your thing. Yeah. We're good guys, you know? We're sweet ones. We we we're ten. Is out of this a, this must be an advertisement for yeah, these guys? Because I'm please. baffled. Okay. I'm I'm de- we're we're on we're talking about friendship and thing, and then you're there like yeah, we're good guys. Yeah, of course. What are you we're getting out guys, of this? Yeah, you know I'm a good guy though. So you, oh, you got, do you want to commit with? Somebody? Do you need a friend? Wow. <laughs> yeah, my chief. If you need a friend, call one eight eight. But is that friend gonna be there full time, or is it just for a quick bang bang thing? Whoa! 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 Whoa. I never said any of that. Whoa. That view was Serafina's, not me. Not Jam- Jamili. It was Serafina, innit? I'm just saying that. I'm baffled. What's, it, what's this friend thing? You have a friend. Uh, was it? You got a friend? Do you, do you want a friend to come over? Yeah. And what is that friend going to do? Chill Be it. your friend. Be a friend, fam. We could just chill. Play play PlayStation or Xbox. And those girls who could play blinking PlayStation or Xbox. Nah, some, 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 I know some. Yeah, I know some, bro. I'm not gonna okay, lie. Okay, what if they can't play Xbox or PlayStation? Play well, cards, bro. 
And then no, what? Do you, know, do, you, do you know how to play cards? Do you know I don't know how to play blackjack, you know? Mm, okay. It's just 21. I don't know how to yeah, play 21. 21. Do you know how to count? Yeah. You know how to add? Yeah. You know how to play blackjack? Oh. Yeah. Well, why, when, when I was at uni, no one used to let me play. Because <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't play it. Like quick Monopoly game or something. Okay, yeah. but what so, are you getting out of it? There's, do you know what? You don't need Don't anything. you think a friendship is a transaction? You, you, mm. you pay into something to get something back. I'm paying into time to be able to say, yeah, I had a good night with my friend. I don't have no stress. I can go home and think, oh, yeah, yeah. my guy ain't stressing me. If yeah. I remember, wasn't stressing me. I ain't spending no money. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I have no commitment. So would you still have this friend if you, if you guys were in a relationship? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah. I've done it. I've done it too. Fair enough. I'm well, seeing, I'm seeing, I'm seeing, I'm seeing, a, I'm seeing one girl and I'm seeing girls, certain girls and I'm just there like, yeah, these are my female friends, isn't it? And they're like, Oh, when they asked me like, oh, like one girl, f- I'm not even going to lie to you. Yeah? yeah. I asked, I was seeing this one thing and then I think she asked me, who's your female friends? Da, 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 da. Like, who are your female friends? Obviously, she didn't know any of them. And so I showed you. Like, oh, that's my homegirl, isn't it? This is my homegirl here. And she's like, oh, so how do you know her? Yeah. She's like, well, my homegirl, isn't it? Like, she's from, she's homie, isn't it? Mm. Like. What, what's her situation like da, 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 da. I'm like she's in a relationship like <laughs> so and then that's what makes people feel good isn't it like oh yeah that's fine then yeah let's say she, yeah I think that's the one thing and I'm just there like so what if I didn't say she was in a relationship do you know it's funny would that change your mind about yeah. me and... automatically they think oh yeah they're fucking fam I not can't all lie. the time bro it's true though. If, the thing is if I'm fucking my uh, fucking one of my friends fam I'm not their friend bro yeah realistically we're not friends I don't know. I, I think I, I think when you get in a relationship, you just naturally lose your. Well, you're still friends with the girls, but it's just not as close as before. I think I'll still be close. Do you? Yeah, because I communicate how I feel. Mm. I've got three friends. No matter what, I'm gonna be friends with them. Regardless, mm-hmm. and yeah. do everything the same. But I'm saying that if you're in a relationship, then you might not really have time for that friends. I wouldn't say we I have, have time. time. For... Oh, okay. I wouldn't I say I don't. I, I agree with her to a certain degree, but at the same time, it's like everyone's got a life. Like, you know I mean? shouldn't have to... So we shouldn't have to say, like, we don't have time for each other. Like, mm. you know what I mean? If you're important, you'll make time. Yeah. That's true. Oh, <laughs> if I speak. <laughs> <laughs> oh, when you said to make time. Listen, I have... Uh, I'm not going to lie. Uh, to be honest, before me and her split ways, this girl, mm-hmm. when I was seeing, she kind of made the... She, what you said, like, when you... Yeah. When you're important, you when, make time. Yeah. Mm. It's kind of true. But at the same time, when it would come to her, it was because I didn't have much time mm. for her, like for her, which which was my fault. But mm. at the same time, like if you know my, if you knew like what I have to go through throughout the day, like I can't just keep calling you like just to see how you are. Kind of, I can't text you to see how you are. Like I have certain obligations. Like you know what I mean? Have you ever? Have you guys ever had sex with your close friend, girlfriend? No, no. God forbid. To be honest, if I the thing is, I I don't think I could do that, bro. I find my I have attractive friends, yeah, but I don't see them in that way mm. because they know certain things that I haven't not told anybody, mm. and I know certain things that they have never told anybody. Mm. So it's like there's a boundary. There's a boundary, don't bro. Cross it. Yeah, don't cross that, bro. Like. And like, luckily enough, all the women I'm are my female friends know know who I am as a person. Like you're one of them. Like you know, you know who I am as a person. Anyway, so yeah, man, don't get threatened though. But you are gonna test the girl that I'm gonna be introducing you to. I know you're gonna test them. That's a fact. Do you think? Yeah, I think you would. I think you will. I'm naturally, not, I'm, you'll I'm do just, it naturally though. I'm just a fun, happy person. No, you ain't. No, 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 no. No, you ain't. As soon as the guy friend brings around a new girl yeah the female friends are like what is she like yes what you're testing them to, to the a certain table? degree you naturally. guys don't even know that you're doing it you guys ask these questions and think yeah it's just normal conversation but really yes, you're sir. like Mm-mm. do i like this person mm. yeah is she good uh, yeah. Mm. yeah yeah i know yeah that is true though i think you'll do it mm. i think you do it but i think because well, i think yeah as a female they'll notice things that we won't notice yeah, yeah true, true true that's why that's why i, I prefer having I, I like having female friends around me mm-hmm. who have good energies yeah no, and confident you. you know what i mean so like when um 
like when I went to went out for my birthday, I went mm-hmm. with all females. Yeah, fam, I had the best time of my life. Yeah, I st- I looked like I was like a blibbed like a baller, bruv. Three pe- four pen girls right around me, fam. You know what I mean? That's a dance angels. Trust me. <laughs> Trust me, I got. I was moving like a Charlie's Angels thing, fam. Like you know, what I mean, I was on the table. There's four paintings around me, fam. I felt so nice, cause having a oh, shisha and a good. drink and that food. Then Amanda w- um, then went to what you call it, get another drink, and all of that. Everyone's raving. Jeez. Sorry, this question is bugging me. It's really like random, yeah. All right, cool. Forgive me, but if you guys there were in a relationship for let's say three years. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Okay. Would would you ever consider having a threesome? Ooh. No, it's just something that you and your your girlfriend is up for, or your girlfriend wants it as well. Would you ever spoil what you have for a threesome? Is this a birthday thing? Yeah, it could be something special. It could be a one off. Or I don't know. What What do you uh, think about that situation? The thing is, I'll tell you what I think. I don't know. You know. I've never had a threesome though, so I don't know. I like the thought about it. But not yeah, in a relationship. the thought in a yeah in a relationship is a bit mad. Okay. Because if the girl if the girl that comes into the sh- into the thing is mad, that is the that's that is peak your for you. that is your girlfriend. It's peak biggest for you. fear of a threesome. Exactly, <laughs> that's what I think. For me, as a girl, yeah, I'm thinking, what if my boyfriend prefers the other girl? More. And then that's what I mean. They have like, a like yeah. little time away, and I'm just there. A lot. Of, uh, that's why I, I'm thinking I w- not I don't in a know, relationship. Man. That's why I'm thinking not in a relationship. But if it was single, if you were single, and then they were like they're friends, and what if your girlfriend begged you to do it? Like she really was honest with another dude. No, no, no. With nah, you're moving. No, nice. with another girl. <laughs> with another girl. Yeah. And do I get to pick or? What do you mean? Do you get to pick? It, 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 it ties down to it, like. You do, get to fuck get to both pick? with them. Yeah, but do you no, get to no, pick who it is? The girl. Oh, uh, right. No, she she know like she's got a friend that what it is. <laughs> is she, I need to know if she's buff. I need to know if she's. She's buff. all right. <laughs> she, she's all right. You know what I mean? As in, she's like a, she's like somebody that you would usually go for. <laughs> but it says all right. Like not even a certain thing. <laughs> all right, you know. I'm done. She's just somebody that you would usually go for. <laughs> Uh, but the thing is I don't have a type you know what I mean you know I don't have a type yeah so okay so uh, anybody as as you, uh, that's as... attractive was it? just remember that am I gonna get brought in <laughs> <laughs> was that back in the day yeah, yeah I okay. wanna hear but cool later yeah, 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 yeah. but I, I don't know if I don't know to be honest I don't know I, I, until I've been in a threesome, I can't. No, but it's gonna be something no, new they, for both of you. Yeah, she I hasn't. Know. Oh, okay. She hasn't either, but like her her friend is like really like on it, on it. Her friend. Yeah, you don't know the friend like that. Like it's not gonna be awkward one. Like <sighs> that means I kind of <laughs> desired her though too. No, it's like a random thing. She's but you like, said a friend, though. You said a friend. That's what I'm thinking. Of yeah, so... If it was a random thing and that we have an opportunity... Okay, with, you met the random thing in the club. I'm on that still. Would you do it? And you're in, the, you're in a relationship for two years with the girl. I can't do it. I, I don't know. It's a possibility, but at the same time... And like, your, your girlfriend is the one that it, really a one wants thing. to do it. It's a one-night thing. Yeah, but then you might you might enjoy it, innit? Yeah, that's, that's what I mean. That's the risk. That's, that's the risk. I can't do it. Because imagine having especially one Especially with a random girl especially Okay if it's the girl's had... friend For for him it's the random girl For you it's the girl's friend That you don't really know too tough You've heard about her You haven't met her But you just Like it was somebody from Like back in the day But at the Cause... same time as well Like You know you've had one girl, Only one girl for two years bruv Then a new team just comes in uh, It's peak for you that's bruv a, I would I'm happy It's I'm peak sure. fam I'm happy mashing up my same girlfriend, so I'm good. Yeah, I'll be happy with that. But at the same time, if you imagine, like, oh, that's be peak. No, but like my p- thing on this year, mm. if it's the friend, yeah, you guys have talked about certain things already. Mm. You guys know what certain people are working with, mm. so it's not really anything new that you're expecting. Like that's the two friends. 
I'm dead. Like, that's the two friends. <laughs> I'm not opening it. Are you, are you know you know you're going to, or you're gonna get your friend to open it. Or I'm something. not gonna open it, bro. Do you guys do that? What? When like, you, you know, you know, you or know. Do you like, like screenshot? You know, this is Snapchat, by the way. When you screenshot and try and zoom into the circle. No. Okay. I do that, bro. Just to see, like, I'm not gonna open it because I know you're trying to get my attention, fam. You know them ones? You're, try- you're not gonna, you're not gonna text me. You're not gonna call me, but you're gonna post on it so where I know you could see. I air you with my chest. Fucking I could have, you know. I would want to know. I will get my friend to. You know what? Let me open it just to see. I air you with my chest. Oh, business. <laughs> but um, yeah, like, if it's the friend. Yeah. Oh, you want to do that? Oh wow. You need to do, I I think you should unfollow. I can't though, then it'll be peak. Because obviously so certain... You know me, i d I've got a bad feeling. Anyway, let's not go on to it. I'm I'm in a devilish mood right now. When a magnum hits, it's a bit mad still. <laughs> I, I think I haven't told you. I don't think you have. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I've got yeah. one little magnum that I need to finish in my pop in my pocket. Oh, bust me a little bit of that. You can have a bit. Yeah, but um, I had a magnum, yeah, mm. for the first time. I was there. Oh yeah, you were there. But I, this is the, the aftermath. Time, you know? This is the aftermath. Mm. <laughs> so man goes out now mm. after the studio after finishing the magnum and that, and then went cinema with um <laughs> with the with the people. Them came back. Came was going home. But then I noticed, and I'm like, my feelings, I'm like, damn, that's kind of, that's kind of feeling the type of way right now, bruv. You know when drink comes up in your head? <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just there like, fam, the magnum hit me. I was just like, I'm going to say, I send a big head, big, hey, big hey, head. Big head. I, I sent it, fam. Mm-mm. I was shocked that she replied back. <laughs> I bet you said, like, I don't want to open it, but I want to open it. <laughs> No, 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 it wasn't on WhatsApp. So oh, okay. was, she can't see if I opened oh, it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So I was like, fuck. And she, uh, I wish I opened it. I opened it, but I was like, and then, um, and I was like, oh, I was like, are you home or not? And she's like, no, nah, I'm not even home. Oh. I was like, oh, okay. It's like, sorry for disturbing your night then. She's like, oh, yeah, I hope you have a good night. I hope you're not too drunk. Like, all right, whatever. But at the same time, I was like, and then one of my homegirls messaged me because she saw me post like, oh, this is going to be an interesting night mm-hmm. when I posted the Magnum thing. She was like, I'm hoping for no devilish shit, you know. <laughs> I was like, I'm sorry, you're too late. <laughs> <laughs> you're too late, guys. Oh. You're too late. And that that one, mm. that was her. Hmm. Do you know how hard it... No. It's hard to... <laughs> sure, shit. Fam, mm. it's hard out here still. It's hard out here still. Oh, men, men are so we struggle the most, you know, we about this do. about this shit. We do, like you women are so privileged to a certain degree, you know. Pretty women, pretty women. Okay. No, women in general. I think pretty women, bro. There's someone for everyone. Of course, yeah. Women in general. Yeah, yeah. yeah okay. Oh, why are you, why are you struggling? Please explain. Do you know how how brave it is for us just to go up to you, fam? How much courage we need. Think about it. You lot are already on. As you said earlier, you can't take rejection. <laughs> no, I can't. Man, them are built to take rejection because of you women. Yes, trust me. You guys don't want to move to anyone, so it's like we have to go and make that first move. Trust After, me. no, but here's the thing: you guys want to be seen. Mm. You guys make yourself seen for us to then come over to you. Just take that is one that, step further. Is, is that a sign of she wanted to be seen? Yes, that is definitely a sign of she wanted Shall to I be seen. Shall I enter the DMs or not? Was that a story? Yeah. Was in directed it, to you. In it, I no. That's what I've said. Could, I, I could know. just react to it. You get me? Just, just quick time react to it and then just leave it. This is live. <laughs> L- let's see what happens. Yeah, let's see what happens. Man. Because it can go one of two ways. It could be like, <laughs> all right, cool, whatever, or it could go somewhere. Ooh, Wait, I don't minute. know which one what, though. I could. Where, I could react we're to talking it. about this on now. Yeah, yeah, why not? No one knows who it is. She wouldn't know who it is. I don't care. Okay. Um, Props to her, innit? Yeah, trust me. She's a sweet one. Yeah, sweet one. Um, um, I don't know which one, though. You know you know, you have to pick which ones. Oh. What, what's the best ones, by the way? We need to we need to educate the man them, which, um, which is the perfect ones on the got, reacts. Got, got. Yeah, because you got the the funny. What if you picked the wrong, the wrong one accidentally? That's what I mean. I'm sending two it? then, fuck it. Yeah, yeah, I'm sending two still. I'm sending two. Um, 
I've done it before. Oh, um, <laughs> you got the 100 sign. You got the fire emojis, the claps, the heart eyes. Well, isn't it fire to you? Fire, fire. Yeah, but the heart eyes are a bit mad still as well. Or fire, the claps. Fire. Or the hand clap. The hand clap thing. No. Is that, isn't that good? Well, if it, not in that way. You could have what's in the bottle. Yeah. Um, that's fine. I don't know, you know. See, it's either the heart eyes, the celebration, or the fire. The heart eyes are a bit too much, though, isn't it? Yeah. A little bit. Yeah. I'm going to have to pick the fire. The fire, the fire, fire thing. Fire, yes. fire. Yeah, there you go. Take that, take that. But yeah. Um. But no, nah, I don't know, man. Like, it, yeah, it's just hard for us women, men out here, man. It's hard. You don't realize it. I think it's hard for us girls as well, though. In what degree? As in when, so when the guy, when the guy gets to that stage or whatever, when you're seeing each other or whatever, and then, you know, feelings get involved or whatever, and then, <laughs> as in, I, I, oh, I'm not as say in guys anything. don't usually let you know what's going on, you're a bit I like, do. oh, what's going on, I do. sort of thing. I do, though. So straight away, you're like, yeah, this is just sex. Yeah, if I feel like it. Say what you want. Yeah. Say what you want as well. I think it's difficult. I think it's difficult for girls, definitely. Why? It's really not. Why? I want to know why because it's not that hard to say what, how you feel. Females are so in. This... Say what you want. Sorry. Say what you want. Sorry. Females are so like. You've been put on such a high pedestal. Mm. You don't know how to come down from it. Mm. And it's like, as guys, we've tried to help you. Say what you want, because you lot think it like. Even as girls, you are saying, yeah, I just want to have sex with you. Mm. Like, I don't want anything else, but you guys are too scared to say it. Mm. Then you like, will wait and whatever, and it's like... Yeah, you're going to wait point. three months. Yeah, but maybe we don't feel confident to say anything. Yet. Why Why you... Then why pr- bring up a persona then? You're bringing up... Okay. You know, do you know that you're bringing up a persona when we come what up if, to you? What if you start off... What if you start off that it's just that you just won't have sex or whatever, and then you end up getting feelings? That's not your fault. Yeah, it's not your fault, but... Not your fault, but you should have told and me then... that... It, was it... No, but think about it. If you say, yeah, this is whatever, you have the conversation, cool. Then it might go further and further, and you'd be like, all right, this is a nice relationship. Yeah. Because if it builds... If it builds... Like, I women women need to realise, yeah, that we're... We, like, we take... E- this whole thing about... Thing is just whole effort thing, isn't it? It's, it's, it, it takes time. Like, if it's just a sex thing, it's just a sex thing. But at the same time, like, you can find someone to also give you the dick, you know? You know what I mean? Like, you can also find other dudes yeah, to give you the dick. And you still Not come back here. Your dick might be better. Oh, I'm not, I was going oh, to say something. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say something! Oh, my God. But I'm not going to do it. I got from it. No. Um, I was gonna say something. <laughs> Shit. Ah, oh, but yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. Ah. Oh, One hundred. <laughs> you know the emoji. <laughs> Eighteen hundred for the rusty. <laughs> Shout out heady one in that. Um, but no, nah, like if you. But the thing is. It depends for different women, I guess, as well. Mm. Women. You women's are very dangerous. And then you'll say, oh, let's take... Remember when we had the discussion last week about the condom thing? Wait, what's this? We were talking about, like, oh, uh, like, when women don't like using condom during sex sometimes and shit. I can't tell you the last time I used a condom. You're in a relationship. Relationship, yeah. That's Does a that relationship happen? thing. But at the same time, like, for us, like, if we're seeing a girl and it's a regular sex, I think we would have that conversation as well. Yeah, because, exactly, and you don't know, like, exactly, because the, the girl could be fucking about with other guys. You could be. Yeah. And you just don't know, even if you trust that girl. Fucking with other girls, just make up. Yeah. 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 Like, I was like, guys, wait, wait, whoa. No, no. Whoa. <laughs> pause. Pause. Hello, pause. This is the magnum that's getting to me now. Yeah, okay, cool. But, um, yeah, so you just, like, even if you trust somebody, that... One little slip up, that's it. Mm. SDI galore. Mm. But yeah, like I don't know if you've experienced this, yeah. I, I just... But I think in my in my day before I was in a relationship, I I feel like I trusted guys way too much. You know? Yeah, 
You know, you know when um, not that as many. Obviously, you, you, you use condoms. As, obviously, you use both condoms and that. And <laughs> both which condoms do you use? Which condoms do you use? Durex. 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 What the what is, what, purples or reds? Okay, okay. Sorry, relax. this Man. is so quick. <laughs> 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 I just don't that? want to leave. Yes. <laughs> I'll bleep that for you. I'll bleep, <laughs> I'll bleep oh. that. Man. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I will bleep that. But yeah, the purples, reds, blues, whatever. Because I have to use blues. Are you blues. still answering the same question? I got Ask blues. I got blues on only right now. Because because apparently because actually um condoms feel d- different brands of condoms feel different as well mm-hmm. a lot of women don't realize this so oh, like skins are different and other trojans apparently are one different. time I one time I <laughs> trojans aren't that good actually, trojans worry. are apparent I don't know I haven't tried them I watched a thing on Snapchat the other day shout out to Snapchat for making these like great mini series or whatever they're doing oh but yeah it yeah. actually yeah. bangs yeah it bangs, it bangs. Yeah, um there was one about condoms and they tested like trojans with Jurex trojans um trojans got marked differently. Yeah, hmm. like stretchiness, um, how, like the volume and all sorts. I was like, oh. yeah, yeah. I d- d- I don't think women realize that as well. Like, you know what I mean? Like, mate, I I know. Mate, one time I don't know where this this um condom came from. Yeah, I don't know if it got, came free in some I don't know at uni or whatever. But all I'm saying, it felt like one balloon. <laughs> Like literally, it was some glow in the dark thing. I uh, glow in the dark condoms. Oh, I've never I heard of this. You know. All I'm saying, I don't know. Fun care. One second. Fun care. Imagine you're beaten. Your transition. You just see. Oh, bro. The glow. Mad. <laughs> that sun was. It was so like. thick. It was unbelievable. Man, but like, imagine you're beating from behind. You're beating it from behind, and you just it's see a, the glow. Like. You guys prefer having sex in the dark or in? I'll do both. I've done like, both. I've done both. Well, obviously you've done both, but what one do you prefer? I, I don't prefer it. Like, oh really? It's, 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 there's no preference. Matter. Yeah. Even the morning light is the morning light. Poor. Oh. Mm. <sighs> they giving you, you know, throwbacks. Flashbacks. Yeah. You have flashbacks, right? But now, mo- like morning sex, and then the light, the, the morning light. You know what I mean? Just beaming through, like beaming through, and then Good morning. Oof, that's that's the great one right there. But um, no, I don't have a preference. I don't have a, I don't think men care. Do you what care? if it's like a a new girl then? It's been a new girl. A new girl. Like as in like a brand new girl that you're having sex with, and then obviously like, do you feel like uncomfortable? Or... As it is, it the first time you're having sex? Yeah. Like, do you? Feel there like is anxiety. Like you're, I feel like if you're in the mood, it shouldn't matter. Yeah, trust. Uni students don't care. Yeah, at uni all. students don't care. Is that the ones Oy. you're going for? Whoa! Relax with that. Relax with that, but um, I don't know. Like, I don't really care. Like with the whole that thing, as long as we yeah, we're feeling each other, mm. and I'm pleasuring you, you're pleasuring me. Doesn't it matter like that? Yeah, I don't think it really matters. Mm. You know, I've realized I want to go on more daytime dates. Oh, I like that. I like that too. I like that. Why, why been... is everything got to be done at night? Mm, that's true. But it's because it, of, it, time, of timing. Like, timing, maybe. Like work. No, even with like timing, that. like yeah. I I've done it in the weekend like we, when we have both time like mm. you know what I mean, um maybe even d- when I was in uni, <laughs> when I was in uni I dated this girl and um before I left for holiday, um went on a we um I went on a date with her um after uni, it was like round it was like when you finish w- uni early no mm. lectures and that we just went out just went so it went it was like when it was. Starting to get hot like springtime. Mm. Everybody's in the it was in the park and that. Mm. Man just went KFC, got a little uh McFlurry or uh, what's it called? And crush him. Crush him. Crush him and all that. Went to the park, just laid there in the house. What's your best date? My best Ooh. I don't think I have one to be fair. I can't lie. <laughs> Shit, you, you know your boys listening. Just, uh, As in date. like Best date, you got <laughs> you can't be great in my I mean, I mean, he's done really cute things for me. Yeah, of course. It's so natural. I, I could, I could bring that into. We it, do but... bad shit. We're so weak for women. <laughs> That's ridiculous, fam. Mm. We do a lot of things for women, you know. I'm waiting. You haven't come up with anything. Um, um so far it would have to be mm. a hotel. No, no, no. Like we planned because we haven't seen each other for so long. I was like, cool. Like, pack a bag of stuff. This yeah. is what you need. Didn't yeah. tell her where we were going. Oh. And I was like, 
this is what you're gonna need. Cool. Mm. I'm coming to get you. Yeah. Don't ask me no more questions. And then my G. Go to a nice hotel, had dinner, whatever. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. And yeah. yeah. yeah me. That's cute. Oh, I. Yeah, we've done things like that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, me. Since I'm I'm the man of the cloth now. Um. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> <laughs> don't even don't even be you need to relax man honestly <laughs> James is shaking his head um best day I've had wow. um to be honest I nearly flew out a girl what oh flew out Bro. I thought you said the threw out a girl I was gonna say Bro. like we're gonna go somewhere oh. how long are you lot talking for um Few months, yeah, few months. Cool. Um, nearly did that. Um, because we were talking about like holiday spots or whatever, like just in Europe, you know the months. Um, not not like you know what I mean going to Barbados and that fuck that shit. Oh no no like yeah yeah it's not I'm not. Well, I wasn't man. expecting that. That would have been a bit mad. Especially no, if you're there's not certain man out, out with her. I'm sorry, no. but there's certain man out here that would do that though. Certain man out here that would do oh. that. Um. Someone but, decided to turn on the um J- uh, Drake ticket because she didn't want to go on a date. Oh yeah, yeah. I saw that. But oh. then he still bought her another ticket. He still bought her ticket, bro. Yeah. I don't know. I don't but um, know. there's also uh, the one that I liked personally. Definitely was um like going for a walk to a suspension bridge at night. Oh. Yeah, I'm back. That's a banging view. Do you know that is so cute, you know? But then with me, I start f- um, thinking of like scary things and things like mm. that happen. <laughs> no, it lie. was just a quick walk. You know what I mean? It was night time. Yeah, I mean, it's nice and nice and. You know I mean? My second favorite one would be the day that we binge watched Harry Potter. Oh, Harry Potter. Oh, cool. I'm not really a fan, but me, that's cute. If you're a fan, me was probably. Wait, I'm baffled. <laughs> was it not sp- suspension bridge? No, no, I'm talking about the second one now. Oh, he did, okay, he, he okay. He did the second one. I'm doing the yeah. second one. Um, I'm not gonna lie. The activity day golf. Crazy golf, golf yeah. Band. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> She knows who that's it is. why I'm laughing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, she was, that was one of my favorites. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, and when I had... like activity dates, though, I like activity dates. Yeah. When so. you binge watched um Harry Potter, did you have all the cute stuff like popcorn and that? Oh no. Oh, I would love that, but it would See? have to be a reality show. Oh, you like <laughs> reality shows, isn't it? Yeah. I'm just saying though, men will do a lot of cute stuff for women. You so know. let me tell you, when I was crying, right? So <laughs> she said, "Cry." I was crying. So obviously, as you know, that my boyfriend lives in London. So I came back from Jamaica, like, the what day did I go? And I had to go to work straight away. I was just having a really shit time at work, yeah? Mm. So we're, I'm on the phone to him. We're always on the phone to each other at lunchtime. He's like, oh, yeah, I'm just in the gym, like, blah, 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 blah. And then he was like, um, so then he was like, oh, yeah, I'm at, at Costa Coffee, like, doing work. He wasn't work. in the gym. I feel like I know where this is going. Sorry. Finish yeah. your story. In it? Sorry. So um so I'm talking to him, talking to him, and then I was like, uh, and then like and then one point he cut off the phone, he's like, Do you know I have to go that like, quickly? I was like, Okay, cool. I was like, alright all right, then. So anyway, um I got at home, had a shit day, and then it's so weird because the time before that I was like, Oh, I really want to see you, blah blah blah, but we have to wait till the weekend, whatever. And then um so I'm on the phone to him, I'm at my house now, lying on my bed, looking mash up, and then he's like, Oh yeah, maybe you should have a shower. I was like thinking, what? <laughs> I was like, Yeah, just like get ready or whatever. I was like, Oh no, 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 like like to put my pajamas on, because that's what I usually do, go home, put my pajamas on, blah, blah blah. I was like, I can't be bothered. Anyway, I heard I hear a knock at the door, and then I, I was like, Oh, somebody's knocking at my door. So I opened up the door, saw nobody. Then I shut the door, knock again. I saw flowers, a present. This was on Valentine's Day. And we don't do Valentine's Day. We do not do Valentine's Day at all. And literally, I was crying so much. I was just like, oh, I can't believe you've done this for me. That like, I was, oh, that was the best thing that he's ever, ever done for me. And then we went crazy golf as well on that day. And had our little, the little deal, in it? Isn't it sweet? The deal? It was like, I don't know, go crazy golf. For two um, people for twenty pound and uh, get a yeah. free beer or something stupid, um, but yeah, he came all the way from London and he was on the phone to me the whole time. And I didn't know that he was outside. Mm. So cute. <sighs> See what I mean by men will do a lot. Of sh- men are weak for women. And then one time he we'll flew me out. To, he flew me out to um, Venice. Get flew that on my birthday, but it was the only reason why he done it because we had one massive, massive, massive 
argue with. It was his fault. You know, I'm sorry, madam. You know, you know, you know the words. <sighs> you know when you was you you, you had lost resort. <laughs> you were, you lost he, resort. He even said to me. He even said to me, if this doesn't work, then. Obviously, you know like, what I mean. You know the last resort be... ones. Mm-hmm. Just like, fam, I have to make this right, cause Basically. I have to make this right, fam. Basically, oh. that's all. But the thing is, with me, if I do something wrong, I know I'm gonna tell it. Oh, for me, anyway. You're gonna tell it. Yeah, I'm gonna say like I was wrong. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah but when the woman, I wasn't having it though. Actually, also, I'll speak to you guys about it afterwards. Yeah. and See your thoughts. Actually, can I can I ask this a question? Yeah. Yeah. Why do um women like to test men? What do you mean? With like when you're dating. Carry on. I like, want an example. <laughs> so I could really understand. So I was having a conversation with someone mm. and obviously I um me and me and that person mm. don't speak to each other anymore. At that um just parted ways mm. and then i was having a conversation with someone about it and someone they said um oh that was a test i was like why, why would be why would that be a test i'm like to see if you're actually about it i'm baffled i'm like wait what? so you guys will tailor a conversation in your head and then work your responses in real life to see what you're actually on yeah to fight, figure out if you're just trying to fuck or you're trying to have a relationship. Yeah. Oh. I had that. I don't get that. I, I actually, I'm still uh, but baffled. Then, I but didn't then, get it. But then I realised, like, was I actually, didn't, was I actually wrong? Because I was thinking of, you know what I mean, actually contacting mm. that person. But at the same time, I was like, why, why am I doing that, bro? Like, I've already said how I how i felt about mm. this whole thing like yeah. i'd never had ill intentions or anything mm. and that was the thing that you're making me, you're testing me like that just to see if i'm I think, honest I think, with girls, I think with girls we just want reassurance i think that's what it then talk to, to me properly i know but it's not it's not that easy to talk don't sense subliminals hmm? don't sense subliminals, subliminals yeah come out that's what away. pisses yeah. me off as I, well i do the subliminal thing no, nah, you gotta fair. come out straight away and just be like, "Yeah, this is what." This but is I think this it's, was in to, my head. It's, it's to do with the fear thing as well. Of oh, rejection. the fear factor. Okay. I think fear is like. But the, that's not rejection, though. It's just a conversation of like. Yeah, but we don't know how you're gonna react to it, basically. <sighs> no, but how do you plan on getting? It's the fear of the unknown. How do you plan on get tackling it if you're never gonna bother? Yeah. Well, we go around it another way. <laughs> like how certain women like with this whole. Um, like for example, me and me and Josh, yeah, we Shall I bleep his name? No, that's fine. Okay, cool. We were friends with benefits at first year, so we just like met at uni or whatever, we were just, just having sex or whatever. And then obviously I caught feelings or whatever. Ah! <laughs> and then it's one of those things where <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I'm not talking to you anymore because obviously I don't, I don't, I wanted to ask him like, like, what, what is this? But I, I just have been through it. And I couldn't oh do it, so I, just, I thought, okay, let me just lock it off. And you know when your head is talking to yourself, like, yeah, should I do this? Yeah, it's just best that I lock it off because mm. what's the point if yeah, it's just a uh, friends with benefit? And you know you got your friends and your ears like, oh yeah, what's happening then? Are you guys boyfriend or girlfriend or what now? Like, what's happening? And then they're in my ear putting pressure on me and shit. And I just like thinking, okay, cool, maybe I should just lock this whole thing. Should have told them mind their business. Yeah, bro. I hate it when friends get involved, I you know. know. I'm sorry. I've been through it so many times. I'm just there like, I'm not fucking you. I'm fucking your other friend, fam. Wait, what? Like, why are <laughs> they... Do you not say it the wrong way around? No, no, like... No. Oh. no I'm directing As in, he's talking friends. about the friend. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, I'm not <laughs> yeah. fucking you. I'm fucking yeah, yeah, yeah. her. Yeah, like, yeah. You know what I mean? And to be like, fair, like, I was all happy with the friends with benefits thing until... He, the friends that are getting in my ear and be like that's oh, what I so, mean yeah. don't ruin it for everybody fam just cause you're not getting dick this is why you keep a business to yourself mm. but you're then shit, if you keep a business keep to yourself shot. anyway all I'm saying is that sometimes it's good to think because you've got eyes watching you as well what do you mean eyes if you step out in it as a guy I don't care about that shit You've got fr- you've got the friends that could you know. No, what? See, that's the part. thing. Listen, I'm not gonna lie. Let, let, let me go actually go. No, you you because I have a story. Go ahead. <laughs> if you say yeah, you got eyes watching. You're intentionally saying I I like this person. Mm. 
That's not friends with benefits. That's you wanting a relationship. Mm. If it's just friends with benefits, they shouldn't have to be watching. Because you know, you're just there to fuck. And Trust then, me. You Trust come, me. you fuck, you go. No big deal. You come, you fuck, you go. And we'll talk after yeah, the fuck's Yeah, but you can't be... Okay, so... Okay, so if you're... If you... Okay. Is it literally you come and fucking go for friends with benefit? You don't like watch like TV programs. No, I'm not saying that, but I'm saying like no, no, no. But this is another this is another completely different question. Uh, If you're having friends with benefits, is it literally you fuck? No, I'm not saying that. So, but but if you're there, if you're there watching, if you're there watching like like different stuff with them, of course feelings are gonna be there. Mm. You can't get away from that. I'm not saying that. uh, The thing is, yeah. Because I've been in there, I've been in that situation where the girl caught feelings, and That's fair. yeah, <laughs> but I've been, it's also done reverse where I've caught feelings too. Yeah, but they just didn't know how to express themselves because they good, had yeah. feelings as well. Huh? That good, yeah. Pause. Um, <laughs> relax. <laughs> um, <laughs> I've I've because I've been in that same boat where I kind of caught feelings, but they also caught feelings, but just didn't know how to communicate, and I had mm-hmm. to find out after if you know what I mean. Yeah. Again. Women speak your mind. Yeah, it's that easy. It's, it's not that easy. It really isn't. Well, it's, it's Especially if there's an agreement before there and so you don't want to be the person to I've had to the crack. agreement and they still want to... No, but still, here's the uh... thing. There are so many different ways to speak your mind. You ain't even got to say words. Write it down. Send me a text. Yeah, there you go. Write even, the, a phone call from write far me away. Write me an email. A far away, a far away phone call. Do it through the, the DMs. Same, you, don't want, you don't want to see the response. It's scary. Write me a text. Write me an email. Write me a letter. You're still gonna get a response that you're scared to look at is anxiety. No, but even no. so, I like, think about it. Once you've gone and got it out off off your chest, you're like, mm. all right, cool. There's, only, know, there's literally about... only two options. This goes well. This doesn't go well. I can True. move on. Do you? Can you live with what ifs? No, you can't. Then, sh- then there you go. That's you your answer. Can't, That's your answer. It will make you go mad. To be fair, think That's your answer. It. You regret 100 percent of the shots you don't take. Mm. That's your. That's that's the answer. Then, if you don't like what ifs, then don't do them. Don't have them in your life. See, it's bending like Beckham aim for that top corner. Trust me, bro. <laughs> Trust me, like, bear techers. Get me. You know what I mean? Like, Messi. Left foot free kick, top corner, bro. You know what I mean? This is what I mean. Oh, that's Stephen Curry halfway through. Yeah, trust me. I don't even know what you guys are talking about now. 0. But anyway, I, know, I know that's basketball. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah 0.5 yeah. on the clock, in it. Fourth quarter for Buzz championship beat, finals, bro. You know what I mean? Yes, Shout out to more basketball listeners, fam. Shout out to you, man. <laughs> but, um... No man, that's we we Celtics fans over here. Just oh, shut up, bro. Um, I'm a Celtics fan only at the East. West, I'm a Lakers fan. So yeah. Um, as a converse, as um, uh, wait. Um, as a conversation, yeah. Um, this whole sex with one round thing. This was that was going on Twitter. Um. I'm not, Did you see it? I'm not drawing no. it in. There was this I conversation guess. about... Yeah, that's fine. Um, <laughs> this conversation about like um, women don't like having sex only for one round. That's a lie. Yeah, I know. But apparently... I would, actually, only... I would draw it in actually at, yeah. at this point. <laughs> because... Because girl, apparently yeah. like man them don't like... Uh, man, If man can only do one round, then they're not... They shouldn't count the body count or some shit like that too. No, but see, that's a lie because that's if... Bit, if we are having sex and I've blown your back up for 45 minutes straight in the first round. You ain't going for round two. You're done out here. Mm-mm. Energy. Like, you're done out here. Energy. So, for you to say, yeah, I want round two. But the thing is, not all, you can't last 45 minutes no, no. every single no, first round. No, but that's what I'm saying. It's not every single first round. I'm just saying, like... I'm just saying that too, though. Guys, really and truly, how often can you go for round two, like, Straight away? Because I don't think that's possible. What, straight away? Yeah. Mm. Been for a couple of times. For a couple of times too. There must be shit then. No, nah. no. You just have a nice recoup time. Yeah. No. On that day, you're just or feeling healthy. Or sometimes like when they're fire naked, you just, it just bounces back up too. That day, you're just feeling very healthy. Yeah. Like, okay, let's go. You got bare energy again. Yeah. I can't what? lie. As I'm getting older, I can't even bother to have sex anymore. <laughs> <laughs> like what are you literally, kiss and cuddle and go sleep. Yeah, like, that's that's sleep. what I want to like. Okay, fair I enough. Hate oh, co- oh. I'm, I am I am like that. Yeah, but then once I start having sex, yeah, then I get in the mood. But like the the thought of it is just like oh, I can't. Be I think it's because you're thinking about it. Is sex a chore to you? 
Is sex a chore? Oh, it's no, it's answer. not. No, 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 no. But the thing is, I... if you keep thinking about sex, then I think you think like that. You think, so... You'll think it's t- you're tired or whatever for it. Yeah. If you stop thinking about it and when it happens, it happens mm. and you get in the mood naturally, you'll just enjoy it more. Mm. But that's well, just me, it's, it's weird, isn't it? Opinion. Because no, that's the same with my, me and my girl. Like, I didn't expect anything to happen. Mm. I'll just go around and be like, I'm just coming to chill. Yeah. Mm. Everybody say, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, literally, I just went around to chill. And then I'll be like, okay, this happened. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, okay. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> so, yeah, like, that's how I was like. I was like, this is actually fun because I'm not expecting anything. Yeah. And you're not expecting anything. It's Amanda, we should not expect sex when we go around a girl's house. Even in a relationship. In general, we should never. Yeah. Because if it happens, you'll enjoy it. Yeah, but I think it's different if if um you live in like a different city for like yeah yeah, yeah. but it, really, but the, really the, the, in the city come on if you don't see each other all the time yeah but that's not this this it, it differs nah. though I think regardless if you don't see each other and you, obviously if you don't see each other for like three four months then I get it mm. but when it comes to like maybe I'm still I'll, not expecting nothing I'm, I'm still that's you but. <laughs> <laughs> no, because think about it. I'm not I expecting just, anything. Man, what's my... As soon as it gets to that point, I'm like, oh, Rod, this is how we're going. And you have that sex for three, four months? Tell me that's not the, one of the most amazing beats you've had in your life. Yeah, but come on, man. Four you've been, months. You've been with for a long period of time. And they're like, you know, you're, like, you, you're not expecting it at all. Like, you just call on a nice day. You're like, mm. just chilling. And it's like, all right, cool. You start kissing. And then it gets to whatever. I'm not whatever. gonna lie. You just feel like it, it, all that time that you missed each other, you're just like, I've actually missed you. But when so it so <laughs> much, uh, uh, sound like you guys are speaking from experience. You know? <laughs> wow, <laughs> everyone's looking in the air and shit. <laughs> uh, no, it's I, a different yeah, type of beat. No, Trust I do. Me, it's I a do. Different I type do know of what feeling. You mean. Yeah, feeling. Yeah. Uh, I just feel like being on the pill has. I think you need, I told you before, you need to do research on the pill you're using. Do you know what? Right. So basically, in my personal I opinion, feel like you have to do research on the pills, anything you're using, just in case, so because it might affect your actual body. It's true. And I think it's something that people should talk about because, um, so for example, I've been on the pill since I was, I used to get really, really bad period pains, like horrible. And like, I, there's nothing that I could do except from going on the pill. Yeah. So I've I was talking to my manager about this year because I get really bad period pains anyway, get really bad headaches or whatever. And I work for a company that does supplements and things mm. like that to help your body or whatever. Yeah. So she was like, Do you realise that you don't know how your body like your natural body hormones are like at all? I was like, Shit, I've been on this thing non stop for nearly ten years. Oh wow. And of course, obviously the pill that I've I've had like ten different pills because of like different like like you said you need to research or whatever research, and yeah. this one i think has just made my sex drive go all the way down mm. like literally i used to be like a rabbit now now i'm like an old woman like, and amanda <laughs> got pills now too are you taking that are you mad trust me yeah me and then it's like a thing where i want i want to come off of it but i don't i yeah, don't want a baby yeah, yeah, yeah. and i don't want to use condoms so. <laughs> this is what i mean she's in a relationship though but you know when you know <laughs> I speak. I just want to know what my hormones are doing. I want to see do, what my. Do you know what? Body yeah, like. think about it. Just schedule it for like one week, a month. Try a month. I'm not taking a pill. Let's try it. Okay, because you guys are gonna be godfathers when I have children. Whoa, whoa, no, but whoa, think whoa, about one, it. You... Just saying, you can last a month without sex, can you? Oh, that's why I said yeah. a week. Yeah, but that's not my speaking to my manager. She said I would need at least six months off of the pill whoa. because. <laughs> your hormones will go mad but because because I need like you need just because you don't like using condoms you will take the pill listen tell your boyfriend no sex for six months see your beat when you come back trust me trust me I don't think, that would, I don't think that would I don't even think that would work to be <laughs> nah fair. nah listen if it's worth it stay. you'll stay fam uh-uh. just stay huh. I'm just saying like <laughs> shit I don't know if I could do that because would you take the man pill nah you just don't know what it's doing. No. Right? No. I'll wear the condom happily. And because and it's not going to stop you. But from the thing SDS is, I've had... I've had sex with a no condom. I've said to, had sex with a condom. And it's a very, very different feeling in the mm. spectrum. I, I don't even know. I can't even remember what it feels like with a condom. And a lot of women prefer 
the non condom way because it feels better mm. for their desire, but at the same time, we also have to be safe. Yeah. Um. That's why the conversation has to be had, of like before even having sex for the first time. I was like, I I always ask like, are you sure? Like, well, we got to get, I got to get the condom, and she's mm. like, ah, don't worry about it. Sometimes or there's it's some... hard for a guy, you know, because they could say it's all right, and then two twos they missed one two days ago. You don't know. Well, yeah, well. but at the same time as well, like um. There, there are complications on that. Like, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, if you say you're okay, that means you haven't had sex in a while. You're not fucking anybody else. Mm. And that's our assumption. But also, if we reach for the condom, mm. it kind of ruins the mood as well. Yeah. So sometimes I'll risk it and yeah. say, yo, I got to get the condom like quickly. Yeah. And, and, see some, where that goes, and yeah. see where that goes. But at the same time, she could just like, don't worry about it. Mm. And that means I'm, that means you're going to be on the pill. You mm. are on the pill, but mm. at the same time, you could be lying. Yeah, exactly. So, well, not that they're lying; they just missed one. And also, mm. not every man them is go- not every guy because obviously every guy is gonna come in with at least two, three rounds. Mm. So, you're not gonna have a condom for every single round, mm. unless she has condoms too, yeah. which I hope all <laughs> yeah. women do supply they condoms. Should. Yeah, because it's quite expensive, isn't it? <laughs> women, women, women that don't supply condoms. What are you doing? Mm. Like, That's true. like. Don't know don't, you situation. don't need them in your bag. You no. don't need them in your bag. At least have them in your house. Mm-hmm. Tucked away where parents can't see them. You <laughs> know what I mean? So, like, yeah. like, and then, because there, be, there is going to be one round where mm. you don't need the condom. Yeah. But at the same time, you have to, before even that ha- yeah. conversation happens, we have to have a conversation. Yeah. About, are you on the pill? Are you Better actually, sorry. are you actually doing this? Da, 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 da. Are you, you know what I mean? Mm. But at the same time, that kind of ruins the moment sometimes. Yeah, I could imagine. I I've never even thought of that, but yeah, of course it can. It ruins the moment, like yeah, like reaching for the condom is really ruining the moment. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So, you know when you reach for the condom for the first time, you have a sex with a chick, and you kind of ho- you're hoping it doesn't ruin the mood. To be honest, I have that conversation before anyway. Sometimes I, sometimes I do. Sometimes it just happens because I don't accept, expect sex like that. No, I don't expect anything. But like everyone I've slept with, I've kind of been speaking to before anyway. Yeah, that's good. So not never had like a one night stand or anything. I've never. Have I've, you? I have. So I've always like, wanted to twice. know what that's like. <laughs> twice I've had it. So it's like I've been speaking to that person anyway. So I'm like, listen. Yeah. As much as you're fire, I'm not trying to get you pregnant. So. Yeah. Or SDI. Yeah. I, I don't want it to feel bad. Yeah. So I don't bring that one up. So I'm like, yeah, yeah I'm not trying to get you pregnant. Yeah. What's a, 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 a little quick segue before we go back to safe sex? What's what's the longest you you can last like without sex? What's the longest for a man? What's the longest for a woman, do you think? Because I think women have a bigger sex drive sometimes. Women do have a bigger sex drive. They just don't it's weird. It's when, yeah. I'm, was, it's when I'm on my period that I want to have sex a lot. It's because you can't do it. It's because you can't do it. No, but I think I don't know. I think something is released in a body that's like, yeah, you want to. Because why? Why is it when I? Oh, because I'm not on the pill, baby. Because because obviously I'm not taking the pill. I don't know, but there's something that makes me like, yes, I want to have sex so much right now. If I gave you a good plate of food, yeah, and I said don't eat that, how much are you gonna want to eat that food? Yeah, I get you. I get your point. Mm. But I don't know. I don't even think that's that. Because no. half the time I don't want to have sex anyway. No, because it's just accessible. It's just accessible to you. Mm, maybe. Yeah, but what's the longest for us though? You can last without sex. I can last a long time, and it? it's like we were virgins for a certain amount of time. So I guess no, but like even after that, like between the time I lost my virginity and the time my second partner, it was like a year and a half. Yeah, mm. but that's different though, because even when you lose your virginity, mm. what do you really know about sex? Yeah, you don't know the techers like that, to be honest. Exactly. So it's when, like you said, it's when you had a good, good, like say if you just had really, really good sex and then you want to follow well, up mm, with some more good sex. I had good sex later on in my life, though. Yeah. So that's it's a bit different for me, I guess. I lost my virgin to someone that wasn't a virgin. Same. So they were more experienced anyway, so like... Same to a degree, yes. Same. How does that feel, of being a boy? Of what? The thing is, I, I don't, but sometimes I don't believe that we have we have virginity, you know? We don't have a... We're not virgins, to a degree. Because we don't... You know what I mean? No, I know what you mean, but you guys know what I mean. 
Um, I feel in that sense, like because you it's like you've never experienced it and now you have, so you've like stepped up another level. Mm. Mm. True. It's same uh, it's just because of the hymen thing as well. Mm. Yeah, no, that's what I, that's what I mean, mean as well. Like, yeah, that's what I mean. Like you mm. have the hymen. Mm. And I think it's because I attach virginity to the hymen. Mm. It happens like that. Mm. But man, we just you know what I mean? You don't really You put it in? You pop Did two Did you guys times, tell the person out, that you were a virgin when you had sex? Yeah, th- huh? Did you tell the person that you were a virgin? No. Or no. Yeah, exactly. Guys could disguise it. No. Nope. Yes and no. To be fair, I didn't say nothing, guys. <laughs> but obviously it was obvious. <laughs> 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 For women, I guess, yeah, for women. No, because I swear your hymen can heal. Can yeah, it? Yeah, to, to, so it depends, because... Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Your hymen your hymen can heal and break again. Okay. Oh. Um, that depends... Mm, okay. Mm. I'm so, trying to think about the female anatomy now. Hmm, interesting. Mm. But yeah, back to safe sex. Um... Um, yeah, so use condoms. Obviously be on the pill. Obviously do your research. Mm. Um It's not all fun and games. All not fun and games. Should I think we uh, men should get tested more. Uh, everyone I can't should get tell tested you the last more. Last time I got tested. You're in a relationship. Yeah, but that's that's not a good I guess that's not good because you never know. You know what, yeah? With the answer there, I feel like if you say you're in a relationship and you're actually going to go get tested, you have an inclination that your partner's cheating on you. Yeah, I yeah, do. that's true too. That's why I don't get tested, but it's still good to get tested. It's still good to get tested in general. Last time I checked was before my relationship. Uh. Oh, before the relationship. Okay. Just to like make sure I was all clean, which oh, I was. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. Man said this. <laughs> <laughs> you had to. You had to just drop that one there. Isn't it? All clean, all clear. But yeah, like I th- personally like that's all tested thing as well like like <sighs> it's it's tricky man like just because I mean, you get you, sometimes you like get you get scared of going because you never know you get you, you know what i mean there's always there's always yeah, that thing scared, too. but, but that the thing, thing is we also have to remember like it's free and you shouldn't be ashamed you shouldn't be ashamed yeah like it's a free service to help you in a sense because mm. think about it you could be out there Passing it on, pass on something that you don't know you have to trust trust a random me. amount of people. Trust mm. me, and you're just gonna mess up a lot of people's lives. Trust exactly. me, trust me. But I'm celibate, so boy, I'm the man of the cloth. Cause think like that's this is what I think here. Yeah? I may have sex with one person. That person is gonna have sex with maybe another two people. Mm. That per- them that's two. That's how it just gets passed around. Yeah, true. Yeah, but at the, at the same time as well. Um, that's only because you know you know that when we talk to a girl, yeah, and she and obviously we're 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 you know having conversations here mm-hmm. and there, and then the responses aren't too aren't too frequent anymore. Mm. That's a, that's a sign of me. That's the sign of saying she found another guy. There's a guy behind you mm. that she's attracted to, and saying if you mess up, she's Myself, going the to the, is long. the, the line is long. <laughs> the line long. 12 inch sub <laughs> wow. you get me <laughs> that, that long fam forget me <laughs> pause oh my god pause but I'm just saying like it's a big Q listen women have a big Q women have a Q and they don't like to admit it I hate it fam I know cause I oh. know I know there was I don't care Mm-mm. there's a few women that I was talking to and I knew you th- your you girls were so fire that man them that I know would try and talk to you on the low. If I'm trying to talk and to you, and if I mess up, I'm gone. No. I'm, I'm done. I'm I'm put back to the bench. Mm-hmm. I'm going to the bench, and you're gonna take the other starter off. No, but here's the thing. This is what girls understand. If I'm trying to talk to you, I have a certain standard. Why do you think no one else is trying to talk to you? You want me to believe that. It's just me that's going to want to move to you. Yeah. And especially when you're talking to someone, you're frequent and you're seeing someone, mm. more girls end up coming to you for no reason. Out of the blue. Again, forbidden fruit is always the sweet, sure. most tempting. Out of the, out of the blue. Hmm. And then you're like, 
how am I gonna try? I'm enjoying this, but I wanna try what's there. Well, it's a bit mad. And try to do it discreetly. Wow. Sound like a condoning cheating. No, 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 no. No, no you're no, not. No. We're not. Exclusive. Not in a relationship. Oh, uh, uh. I'm talking about exclusive. You're not exclusive. You're, you're not exclusive. Yeah. Yeah. Like you're just okay. in the talking stages. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're enjoying someone's conversation. Women have this little company. radar in their head. Yeah. Mm. As soon as you're committed, as per mm. se, to one certain person, mm. they're like, "I want him now." Yeah. I didn't want him. Then, Especially but I want him after now. one good sex round. I always wonder why that happened. Why? It's what like happened? when you were a kid. Mm. And you always had that one toy. Oh yeah. That you never played with. Trust but as soon as someone else touches it, <laughs> I want that toy. Yeah, I want that yeah. toy. <laughs> Don't touch it. Trust me. Trust me. Especially... You think it's the other way around as well with guys though? Which one? As in like like um as soon as a girl is in a relationship or not or exclusive not exclusive to somebody but committed to somebody yeah. that you like all of a sudden want to start seeing um, them. Not really. I wouldn't say I wanted them. I want them. I'm like, oh, You've changed. That's my head. Okay. Like there's there's a few girls that I wish I did try some, but at the same time, I'm like you've changed. You're you're taking vacations and that. I'll let you live. <laughs> I mean, sounds like jealousy. It's not jealousy. It's just life. It's just like I'm just like you're enjoying. I want the best for you. Shit, I fucked up. Yeah, but shit. You gotta do you. There's women out here that we've we've been with, and you just wish them the best in it. Enjoy life. I think I'll get jealous. But at the same time, just don't. <laughs> that's that's what happens, you know, with women. That's when we what, when we move why. on, when we move on, and you see us with another thing, that's when you want us more, and you'll try and try and ruin yeah, shit. Definitely. I've had it before. I think I would want to ruin shit if if me and Josh broke up, and he was doing something else. I would want to ruin it. I can't lie. Oh, that brought me back to the Snapchat thing again. Shout out Snapchat again. <laughs> oh. oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sponsor so. me, Snapchat. Sponsor me. Why did a girl decide to pay someone that her boyfriend works with wow. to flirt with her? She then was Ooh, like... Oh, I think I know this. Yeah, she then told the girlfriend mm. that, yeah, they were kissing, blah, 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 and they had sex. The guy was like... The guy mm. went on the show was like, yeah, I want a second chance. But he asked... The girl, what happened? Mm. And then he's like, why did you lie? Wow. And the girl was like, I lied because she didn't deserve you. And I thought you deserved better and I want to be the better one for you. Mm. So she's going to ruin the re- relationship yeah. over something so she's petty. because, it. But essentially it's over the girl's insecurity because you don't trust your man. Yeah. Just because he's a personal trainer and he works with women. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, I, would, I don't think I would go that far. Mm. And well, there was this, there was this one story as well on um, Instagram where the guy said, um, "I feel bad cheating on you and stuff like that, but we, I think we can move past it." <laughs> and then the girl's like, "So you think that women, um, men can fuck while they're in a relationship and not catch feelings?" And he's like, "Yeah, yeah, like we don't need to do that." And but she's like, "But I fucked one of your friends though." I fucked the guy you played basketball with. Yeah, I watched that one. He had to unbutton his shirt. The man unbuttoned his shirt so quick and did this. I don't know how to feel about this. (laughs) Was that real? Yeah. Uh, Yeah. Uh Uh-uh. Yeah. Type in second chances on Snap. On On Snapchat. On Snapchat? Yeah, Yeah. it's there. What's this? They're doing like little mini video series and that now. Snapchat is going ham. It's it's going ham still. There's this woman woman that's uh, like addicted to bodybuilding there. I've not seen that one. Yeah, yeah. It's on YouTube. It was on YouTube as well. Um, she's like, she can crush watermelons with her legs. <laughs> she's got like thick legs, like thick bum, thick legs. She's like yeah. super, like you know what I mean. But she. What do you think about bodybuilders? Do they make you feel like sick? Like if you, if you. What were, do you mean for men? What for do you men, mean? Like w- girls that are really like muscular. Okay. Um. It depends how muscular you're talking. My friends muscular mom, legs, muscular arms, muscular shoulders. Like every no bodybuilder, like proper bodybuilder. Uh, I'm not really attracted to that. Yeah, though. I'm. I'm just not attracted like to any. I'm not attracted. If I'm attracted to someone, then it's fine. But I'm not really mm. attracted to. I mean, I'm not saying a girl that go to gym. Like I respect girls that go to gym. I yeah, go there's gym. certain girls in the gym that I, I go gym in. Hmm. Oof. Mm-mm. I'm gonna subscribe to this. Gym. Sweet one. 
But um, uh, there's enough episodes, you know. Stop it. Yeah. There's bear. Season one. What is this? Season one and season two. You know. Yeah. yeah. It's wow. not just doing bits. They had World Star in there too. I was like, yeah, that's sick. Because oh, um, obviously IGTV in that mm. as well. What are you doing? Ooh, ooh, that's so cringe. What? I'll bleep that name out. Okay. Yeah, I'll bleep that name out. Oh, I can't watch that. <laughs> <laughs> I'll bleep that name. Oh. I just can't remember what I was gonna say. Oh, my friend's mom's a bodybuilder. Oh, sweet. And I was like, you're doing your thing. Going to your competitions and coming, whatever. Yeah, competitions are like mad still. But I'm just like, some of them, I can't be attracted to you. Mm. Like, you've done so much like work on your body. Like, well, you're henchier than me. Yeah. I think that's what... Would that make you feel insecure if a girl was henchier or could lift more than you? Yes. My girlfriend lift more than me? Yeah. <laughs> I'll see you when I can lift the same amount as you or more. <laughs> Don't God. come back to her then. I would say, I would Goodbye. say, you know, I would say you know when Savio Alonso with well. the boots and his like, says bye. <laughs> that meme. I'm doing but why that is wrong. that? Why is that an issue though? So I think it's ego. What? It's ego. It's ego. It's masculine. Toxic oh. masculinity and ego. Yeah. It's ego. And there's so also what? there's a situation where men are men are scared in, to get... no in society men are portrayed as the protector, isn't it? Yeah. So for your girl to be handed in, you're just like, what is your job as a man? Yeah, trust. Imagine a woman that could box you, brother, anytime. Yeah, but even if you, even if, like, we've had this conversation, like, ages ago as well, like, um, if you went out to a club or whatever, and then somebody's hitting on your girlfriend, and the person is completely bigger than you, like, the guy is bigger than you, how mm. how would you deal with that situation? I, you know what I said, though? You know what I said? I'll go up to and say, yo, bro, that's my girl. Like, even if, into, even if he's it. intimidating. I've done it. Because, think I about thought, it. Oh, I would like girl. to be a guy. No, no, no. no. That's, that's the thing. That's a re- like, guys have a respect thing. Mm. For you... To come up to me and I'm a lot bigger than you. I'm yeah. like, yeah, you're actually you actually believe in yourself. Yeah. The fact that you think you can actually take me, mm. I'd be like, all right, cool. Like, yeah. it's not it's not a take me thing. It's just like uh, it's just mutual respect. Like, bro, like that's what my girl. Like, like relax, bro. With you? Huh? What if he wants to start a fight with you? Why would he start a fight for? <laughs> I don't know. Just because of a girl, that means he's just insecure about himself. One, you're a waste man, and two, I can <laughs> fight. So no matter what. Let's, let's yeah, I can fight too a little bit. Yeah. If you're swinging, let's swing it out. But there's no need to fight over a girl. Yeah, why are you fighting over a girl when there's other things that... here? There's other things, you know. They like, I'll nice. wingman you if you want. But don't trust me, <laughs> trust me. I'll even introduce you to one of my female friends, bro. Oh wow, fair enough. And I know you'll probably like them. Mm. <laughs> Facts. Like, I don't. All get, I'm saying, all that. that situation. That's when I'm glad I'm not a guy because I just feel like it's really intimidating for. If you're not big or whatever, like, mm. I don't know. It's no, but it's not necessarily you've got to be big. Yeah, but you're going to feel some sort of way if you're, like, somebody really scrawny. No. I felt that way a little bit. I think I, I get what I mean. I felt like that a little bit. But at the same time, I was like, that was when I had the feeling of, like, skinny guys can get girls too. So. <laughs> you know what's funny? When I went into school, like, year seven, I all, because I had family members up, like, year nine, year ten, mm. I had to make a point of, I'm not going to be bullied because mm. as like in a primary school I was bullied as a child mm. and I was like I wasn't popular I made a point of I'm not going to let anyone fuck with me mm. so I literally found the biggest kid mm. and was like yeah I we're going to be friends or we're going to scrap it out mm. ended up scrapping ended up being friends oh really so yeah That's a good... and it's like I have one friend every single year through secondary school apart from year 11 we had a fight Really? Like, full-on fist fight. But to this day, I know it's all love. Yeah. And even, like, even that sort of stuff at school, that's, again, is, like, your ego and stuff like that, the mm. alpha male sort of thing. Going through all of that is just... That's just too much for me. I'm glad that I don't need... And even, like, with sports, I feel like if you're a guy, yeah, like, you should know at least one sort of sport that you're into. It might not have to be football or whatever, but if you don't... If you're not into some sort of sport, you're seen as, like, oh, yeah, you're not really with it. Like, I, I like basketball. Yeah, American exactly, football. but that's cool. But I'm saying, if yeah. imagine if, like, you meet a guy and you, they're not into some sort of sport or whatever. A woman? Already... Huh? You mean if I don't meet a girl? No, no, no. As in, like, a for guy. You, for girls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Girl. For okay, girls, sorry. yeah. And they meet a guy and they're not into sports or don't know nothing about sports. Don't you think that's like a put off for girls? Okay. 
I think so. Like, they need to have some sort of... So you like... We... A lot of women nowadays. I don't like, care personally, but yeah. I think as a as a man, like you feel like you need to know something about sports. We, yeah. Mm. No, not really. I think we, you. I think women just like a good looking man, mm. a good looking in appearance wise. Like yeah, like him. He posts abs all day on Instagram, like top off and all that. I'm just there, like all right, cool. You're trying to get thirst traps. Sit down. Say no more. Just... <laughs> you I'm, know what's funny. <laughs> It's true, oh. it's true, it's true, you, you know what's it. funny? I raw had to get one of my female friends to like make that collage of my progress. Yeah, so yeah. I was like, I can't be bothered to do it. Plus, you guys like I gave her a selection of like ten photos. Why don't you just take the pictures for yourself and then? No, because I took the progress photos. Oh yeah. And then I was like uploaded them every now and again. Mm. And I was like, to her, listen, can you do me a favor? Just make these into a collage because I couldn't be bothered to do it myself and download the software. And then yeah, and I had like a couple people comment underneath it. I was like, I just can't stay. Delete, delete, <laughs> delete comment. Were the, the comments flagrant or? It was the fact that I was in a relationship and I was like, I don't need you commenting on my thing. Oh, yeah. Oh, them ones. Yeah. Swear. That's oops. I'll get so angry. You know? but I, um... No, but then there's other times I'm like, you know what? Just let the comments stay. Yeah. Even while I was in a relationship. Yeah. Like, I'd... I think it's because they, if they can't have, uh, uh, you should be happy that they can't have me. Mm. That's what I think. No. Come on, if it's the other way around, yeah, and your girl's there, but I know you're not receptive to them. I know you're not receptive. You're going to feel right. some sort of way. All right, so here's my opinion on it. Wait, uh, d- let me just finish. Yeah, I need to sit, sit up straight for this. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, okay, cool. Instagram is a magazine, yeah, correct? So we can comment, like, or share the shit. Mm-hmm. Cool. So, personally, for me. If you are, if I know, and you know me, mm. I like beautiful women. Mm-hmm. So if you are beautiful, mm. I know men are going to comment, try and DM you, da, da, da. If you are not receptive to it, that means let the comments fly. Mm. <coughs> but <Sorry. coughs> yeah. when you are receptive <coughs> to it and you are entertaining the conversation... That's where I will become possibly okay. insecure. No, yeah. But at the same time, it, same way, I know I'm not really that buff to some women, so that's not going to be. I'm not going to get comments like that. At the same time, if I actually had a body, no one would probably bat an eyelid for making a comment. To be honest, so. No, I was, under I understand your DMs. Yeah. I understand the DM thing. DM and comments. I'm talking about both. Yeah, I understand the DM thing, but the comment thing now, I just feel like. Come on, if you're there posting like half naked pictures, obviously it's gonna. You're looking for a certain some... amount of attention, and then it's gonna you attract... see certain names every single time. You're just like trying to get attention. Seeing your name. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and especially if they know that you're in a relationship and they're still there carrying on as well. And you know what the worst part is, you'll post a picture with your significant other. They won't like it, but as soon as you post a picture in the mm. bikini right next to it, mm. double tap and comment. Double yeah. tap thing. I don't know. I wouldn't like that to be fair. No, I'll, I'll like it if you're in a relationship. Fuck it. Enjoy your life, man. Shit. No, I mean, I wouldn't like it if my partner's... No, but I'm talking about his scenario. Uh, uh, uh. I'm talking about his scenario. Yeah. Like, I've had, I've had, like, women I used to have a thing for, and then, like, found out their relationship. I'll like the picture and shit. Happy, happy. But would you comment? I would if I want. If I wanted to, yeah. But at the same time, I, I was just like, oh, let me... No, like no, no. It. Like, it's, it's, a- it's, nice, it's a nice picture. You're enjoying a holiday. Shit. Go on. Live life. I don't take Instagram that seriously, though. If you put a comment, you would look like you were sour about it. <laughs> what type of comment, though? Like, what, the eyes with the with the, no, not with the, the, eyes, with the leaves passing by and that? No, but it could be like something like, um, <laughs> not enjoy your life, but like... <laughs> oh, it looks like I'm not bitter, are... though. I'm not that bitter. Yeah. If I was, I would be... If I was petty, bruv, <laughs> I, this show would be dying. Oh, my days. Oh, my God. Mm. I'm petty sometimes. Yeah, so I hear you. You but know what's funny? Females claim they're petty. They have nothing compared to guys. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's true. Now, some women, I know some women, no. are very petty. I don't think that I'm that, that pe- no, petty. No, like, to be fair. women have a certain level of pettiness. Mm. Us guys, we either will build up to it, like, you know, we do not have the time for the backlash. Mm. True, true, true. Because true. we'll be thinking, if I do this, what's going to happen next? Mm. And then he's going to keep on going. And he's like, you know, I can't be bothered. Yeah, true. You lived with it. You moved on. Yeah. But, um, yeah, we got to go soon. 
Yeah. Um, songs of the week. You want to do songs of the week? What have I been listening to this yeah, week? Yeah, songs of the week. Ugh. Oh, shout out to everybody that um will be listening to the Kaleem Taylor episode, which is episode fifty two. Um, you guys won't get that on the YouTube, but you'll only get that on SoundCloud, Apple, Apple Podcast app, iTunes, and Spotify. So that's the only places you'll get it, not on YouTube. Um, so shout out to Kaleem, Patrick, and Danielle for setting that up as well. Um, yeah, music, I'm trying to think. music, music, music. Um, you want me to go first or? You can go first. Yeah, uh, I don't mind. You go ahead if you want. So Spotify gave me a nice little gem recently on Friday. What, the, the Discovery new... Weekly thing? Yeah. My G. So it gave me Superpowers by Coltrane and Gold Link. Nice. I'll, I'll put that. That's... It is a very lit song. I was like, mm. banger. Banger. I swear. Sick, sick, sick. You got one? Are you looking for yours? I do, but I don't want to say at the time. at the same time. What did I? I feel like I'd done this one before ages ago. Just say it. I'm just going to do Popcorn, my type. No. Oh, okay. I listened to that in the car before I came here. So oh, yeah. okay. You're a Bashman girl, though. Yeah. Yeah, you like Bashman. Um, for me, I found this um, this girl on Spotify as well um, called Mira May. She got an EP called Care Package, and it's the song called uh, Make Room. Make Room? I'll play it to you guys on the speakers later, mm-hmm. but yeah, that's a vibe as well. Um, the outro track. Ooh. I've been listening to the um to M Honcho's um project Euphoria. I've not listened to it, bro. Listen to it. It's a wavy project. It's wavy, wavy. Um, and I'm gonna put um, what song was it? I wanted to put him and Young Bane, Rock Bottom. That's gonna be the outro song. Um, yeah, that's gonna be the outro song, definitely, because that's a that's wavy. There's there's lots of good ones in there as well. Birds is fire, for real. Um, survive is a tune. TNT with Nave Smalls. Um, yeah, it's just a wavy project, man. Just, I th- I think I like melodic music. I like melodic rap, mm. like that type of wave. So, I guess that's me. But yeah, we were meant to have more people, but they turned up. They didn't turn up. Shit. All right, cool. It's, it's nice to have just. Normal conversation with just yeah, a good you know. convo. Yeah, it's just yeah. good convo, isn't it? Uh, whatever. Um, yeah, thank you for everybody listening. Um, iTunes, SoundCloud, Spotify, and YouTube, Kith and Kin Podcast. Um, Twitter and Instagram, Kith and Kin Pod. Hashtag Kith and Kin Pod to join in the conversations. Um, check out Food to the blog, Food Blog. Um, check out what Jamili's doing on his Instagram. It's going to be in the description below. His eight. ASMR thing. I don't know what you're doing, bruv. Or My cooking. Page. Yeah. ASMR coming soon. Yeah. Um if you want um if you want ladies, if you want him to cook for you at your house and um you know what I mean, get a little happy ending at the end. Wow. <laughs> now I mean um but yeah, anything else? You wanna plug anything? No, you got anything? Uh usually we do. Usually we do. I don't know, man. Anyways. But yeah, peace out. Peace out. Peace out. Peace out. Brow, brow, brow. Oh, yeah. I even forgot that word. Mm. Brow, brow, yeah. brow. <laughs> <laughs> the awkward peace sign. <laughs>